so we are at the 16th of fall and there's festival today let's see I forget what it's called oh geez and as you can see I've like taken hoarding to a whole new level here with all my chests uh you have heard you've been giving some people a hand around town. Everyone seems really thankful. I'm awarding you this month's best neighbor award with a small cash, pr cash prize. Keep it up. Wow, thank you. You clearly have not heard of my misdeeds. Alright. So today is some festival that I can't remember what it's called. Uh, you have to like show off your crops or something. And people said to use the gold ones, but I don't know which ones, like, I don't know how many. Do any of you know how many I'm supposed to bring? Sylvie, I'm, I'm good. I'm glad to hear that you're good too and that you're playing along. It is very fun. Oh, I got this thing, which is like a uh, different kind of scarecrow. But now I can't remember how I got it. <laughs> I was just kind of like playing through day to day. And I got that thing, so. Might have been from the community center, maybe? Okay, Carrie's Awesome says you need nine items from farming, mining, fishing, etc. Do I have to do. Can I do like all farming, or does it have to be a mixture? Does it matter? Also take a jelly to the fair, preferably blueberry. Okay. Get gold stars from as many things as you can. Okay, take a mixture of stuff. Alright. Gah. Open. Okay, um... I do have jelly in there. I just gotta... Also, I made like a bunch of field snacks. <laughs> because I forgot I could make them. So I'll be taking them with me to the mine then. Um, do I get the stuff back? Or... Uh, do they keep it? Because that'll influence things. I'll take a sea urchin, that's different. Uh, where's my blueberry? There's blueberry jelly. I'll take an eggplant. Uh, I'm gonna sell the other ones. I have a decent amount of... Well, that counts as a vegetable, though. You do get them back? Okay, good. <laughs> I didn't want to give him my good stuff and then... Do you think I should put a star fruit? Would that give me, like... I don't know, it seems, like, expensive. It doesn't have a... It doesn't have a star, though. I don't know. I'm trying to think. Alright, we got a gold star quartz, so I'll take that. <laughs> no, stay in my bag, man. Man, nine items. Let's see. Uh, yeah, I'll take this summer spangle. It's a gold star. So that's flower. And this is forage. Oop. I, I need to put these in here first. Alright. Okay, so that's like, what, six things? One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay. Uh, hmm. Hello, succubus demon. Welcome to the stream. Take some wheat. Oh, I have a follow. Thank you, follower. I hope you enjoyed Crash Bandicoot dancing for you. Triple Strike, also a new follower. Thank you so much. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Okay, I need like one more thing. I hope this is enough of a variety. I guess I'll take a bok choy. They're all gold stars, except for... Well, Jelly doesn't have star ranking. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. 
All right, we'll take this stuff and hopefully it'll be good enough. Um, do you guys know when the festival starts? It'll probably tell me. Where is it located? Does anybody know? I don't. I should know these things, but guess what? I don't. Man! Stardew Valley Fair has begun in the square. Where the heck is the square? Man, I need to water stuff. Does it look like I have time for your festivals? No. Water this. Thank you. My person never faces the right way when I'm trying to water things. Never. Never fails. It's in the town center. Uh, is it near the community center? Where the crap is the town center? I don't know what you guys are talking about. Maybe I should look at the map. Oh. Okay, well thank you. <laughs> Water harder? Uh, I mean, if that's what you're into. I can do that. I'm hoping that I'm not, like, l super late, but I really need to water my crops. Like, I can't not water my crops. My dog? Yes, I can not water my dog. But my crops? No. They mean too much to me. <laughs> and near Pierre's. Okay, thank you. Oh, wait. I must collect. I'm gonna, like, miss the festival because I'm a compulsive hoarder. It's a problem. <sighs> Alright. Alright. Oh, whoa. Holy crap. Alright. Shop. Trade in your star tokens. Well, guess what? I don't have that. A fedora? Oh, I want this. A mysterious fruit that empowers those who eat it. The flavor is like a dream. A powerful personal experience. It's difficult to describe to others. I definitely want this, because that would increase my stamina. Wouldn't it? Who the crap are you? Are you strong like me? Smash stone! Uh, you're scary. Put some clothes on. Well, Kita, it's the big day. Our most important festival of the year. The Stardew F Valley Fair. If you'd like to participate by setting up a Grange display, I've left an empty stand for you. Just let me know after you've set up everything. Okay. I guess this is mine. What? Look at Pierre. What? What? Look at Pierre's. It looks all nice. Mine's gonna look like crap. Put the jelly up front. Gotta look at my jelly. If you know what I'm saying. Look at my beautiful eggplant. Put the quartz in the middle. I really don't think it matters, but... Beautiful. I just want to eat this cheese. I'm just saying. Wow, that's the biggest cheese wheel I've ever seen. Very impressive. That's... Interesting. Alright, what- is that a grown man with pigtails? That really looks like a grown man with pigtails. I'm just saying. Get some tickets and bet them if your luck is high today. Best way to get tickets for the star drop. Oh, I don't know if my- <laughs> I never watch TV. I forget that that's a thing. Uh, play the slingshot game and win star tokens. Okay. I seriously never watch- and I should, because you can get- Wait, no. What are you- What are you- Idiot. Thank you, jeez. This is weird. I don't- I don't know how I feel about this. How much- How many points do I have to get? Oh, that was a good one. How many how many points do I have to get to win? I don't know why I'm asking, because it's not like I can look at the chat right now. My score sucks, man. Ah! This is crazy! This is, like, really hard to aim. Go talk to your bae. You have to play mini games and get tokens, and then you can wager them in a random wheel thing. Always pick green. Okay. Seriously, no reward? 
Screw you, man. These weird ass tourists. Get out of my town. Pam's a little, a little drunk, as usual. Try your hand at some fishing. Okay, I guess we'll try this game now. Maybe I'll have better luck. Oh, oh well, okay, fine. Ah! Don't even, don't even sass me, fish. I'm not in the mood after that, after the loss. What are you doing, person? What in the world are you doing? Wow. What do I have to- That Taurus son looks like a gremlin? <laughs> that Taurus son is a gremlin. Don't feed him after midnight. Ooh, perfect. I should get extra points for that. Extra points. Reminds me of the slingshot arrow shooting games in Zelda. Yeah. Yeah, I know what you mean. Alright, uh, does anybody know what score I have to get for fishing? Okay. <laughs> Do I get to keep the fish? That would be so awesome. Probably not, though. No! Fish? Fish! I'm gonna gut you. That's right, fish. Holy crap, that was fast. Alright. Oh man, I'm running out of time. I don't get the fish. That's butt. I was hoping for the fish. 20 perfection bonus. Ooh, 60 star tokens. Is that good? It's more than I had, so I guess it's good. Uh, you know, I would have made a pretty good clown. I think I missed my calling. You're interesting. The clown is, like, drunk, I think. He's a budget clown. Where is Bay? Elliot? Where are you? I would like to see your flowing hair in the wind. You're not Bay, you're just some emo. Yes, I'm having a great time. I have a question. Does anybody know if people's affection for you goes down over time? Because I feel like that might be a thing. And if so, that upsets me. Ooh, Carrie is awesome. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. Where is Bay? Ah, yes. My crystal ball is swirling with visions of your future, young one. Okay. Read it. Captain Quindolin says, remember that freaky clown at that yard sale thing over the summer? Oh my god, yes. Ah, indeed. I see you in a room having a conversation with a lady. Oh, it's Marnie. You seem to be close friends. You seem to be incorrect, but okay. Now I see you in Elliot in a field of grass. You seem happy. Are we naked? Because if that's, if that's it, then yes. Crystal ball has moved on. Ah, you're in combat. There's something dreadful bearing down on you from the dark, but you seem more than ready to face it. Ah, the crystal ball has gone dim. That's all I can do for you, young one. Now just keep in mind that the future isn't set in stone. Whatever I've told you today can still be changed if you set your heart on it. Farewell. Okay, thank you for that. Oh, it's the creepy wizard. Well, where is Elliot? <laughs> like, where is he? Where you go, sweet cheeks. Thank you for the follow. I can't easily read like the names of people following because it's on my other monitor. So if you want to be recognized for your following, just put it in the chat <laughs> that you followed. Seriously, like, am I missing Elliot? Where is he? Did he just say screw it and not come? Because he's a loner. Oh my gosh, a child definitely drew that. 
I feel like these vendors are scamming you. They definitely are. Dr. Dorian says, when you talk to them, you get plus 25 heart points, but when you ignore them for the day, you lose two points. Well, that's stupid. If you don't, if you don't talk to them every day, are you serious? What? That, like, how are you supposed to keep up your friendships with everyone for that? Like, that would be really hard. Elliot, where the crap are you, dude? Is he... I probably can't leave. Nope, can't go that way. I can't find my future husband. Where did he go? Is he over here brooding? Probably. Well, there's Linus staring at the pigs, wondering if he can steal one and butcher it. I think they would notice, Linus. I'm just saying. Harvey, you're so sad and alone. Alright, I don't know where he is. I don't think he came. Silly says, I'm wooing everyone in this game. Female, male, no cares. Gotta see every scene. Lol. End Linus hate 2016. Force Linus friendship 2016. He's always the one who finds me when I, like, pass out and die. There's Bay. There you are, lover. I'm trying to get Gus to tell me his sauce recipe, but he won't budge. Well. You can give me your sausage recipe, if you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying. Talk to everyone. Was that her? Was that her sprite before? Or did it change? I don't know. Make Linus great again. Along with anime. Alright. Uh, what is this? Did I miss this one? No. I'm not gonna buy your freaking... Screw you, lady. Uh, step right up, pick a color, and place your bet. Okay. You guys said green, right? Green? Um, I'll wager half. Sweet. Do it again. Green. Uh, keep doing half. Why Elliot gotta be so saucy? <laughs> He's also the one that takes your money when he quote unquote saw someone doing doing your pockets, someone. Yeah. Linus, we we know your game. Um I'm pretty sure you only win one token from the strength thing, so I'm not gonna do that. And I just suck at the slingshot one. I think these are the only games, right? Like, the slingshot, the strength one, and then the fishing, right? Do I lose stamina when I do this fishing game? I hope not. Captain Quinlan says, gambling like Nan, I see. No, no, no. No, no, no. See, Nan loses when she gambles. I won. <laughs> Dr. Ian says, Linus is being made a dateable character. Are you sure? I heard that Shane was. Shane and I think Emily... Is the other one, I think. I mean, I wouldn't put it past him, but I feel like everyone should be dateable, even if they're taken. <laughs> I feel like that would be an interesting dialogue, like, oh, I went to itch my eyebrow, and then I missed the fish. Wouldn't that make for some interesting dialogue, though? Like, you stole my husband, you wench. I mean, I think that would be kind of interesting, I'm just saying. It'd be like, as Stardew Valley turns or something. Shane is bae. Oh, you get a thousand star things from winning the festival? Yeah, but I don't know if I'm gonna win. Can I play games after they do the judging? Or, like, is it pretty much over? Elliot's surprised face, though. You need to see it. 
I want to see it. I did get his first event. I felt really bad because I was not... Like, it wasn't on stream or anything. I just walked into his house because I wanted to give him a gift. And then it was like, event. And he was being very cute. He was like, yeah, everybody in my family, like, didn't believe in me that I could be a writer. So I just left. I believe in myself. Blah, blah, blah. I was like, your life is so sad, Fabio. <laughs> but Linus is old. So is Harvey. Harvey's old. Oh, wow. 162 star tokens. Harvey is pretty old. You can play after? Okay, good. Let's go do that first, and then we'll... And then we'll keep going. Yes, I'm finished. What? I'm finished. Oh, okay. Alright, let's go. Come on. Pick mine. Pick mine. Pick mine. Pick mine. Pick mine. Pierre sucks. I threw up in it. So, you know, Smiley says older means more experienced. I don't think Linus ha is, like, very experienced in the ways of love. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I'm just saying. Somehow, I don't think... Also, if you want to make that argument, experience could also mean more diseases. <laughs> Alright. Ah, uh, second place? You f yeah, I got 500, though. Don't forget to clean out your thing. Oh, I'll clean it out. Still, 500. Like, I'm not gonna complain. But, I am gonna complain. That's but. Throw up in veggies to win, if only you could in this game. Dude, I would I would have pooped in Pierre's box if it would have meant that I won. <laughs> Let's be real. Green. Alright. I did pick green, right? I did it really fast. Harvey isn't meant to look dad old, though. He's this. It's the stupid facial hair. <laughs> Poor Harvey. Winner! Okay. Okay, let's do like one round. One more round of fishing. And then. And then we'll, uh. I'm sure Pierre would like that. He would. I would tell him that Haley did it. <laughs> Linus is so old. He was the start of the diseases. Oh my gosh. He looks like a caveman to me. I feel like he's been around the block for a while. You know what I'm saying? Like, I really do believe that he's really Fred Flintstone. Like, tell me that he doesn't look like Fred Flintstone. Just, like, really old. Alright, gotta get some more some more coins here. I wish this would make my fishing go up. Like level up. That would be nice. Nope. No, you don't fish. Ha! Gotcha. Oh man, I almost got a perfect. One of those bonus points. There we go. Just as the timer ran out. Sylvie says Linus is a dizzy. <laughs> Poor Linus. Alright, so we gotta get to 2,000. Uh, green. Mmm. Do 250. Come on, green. Oh, phew. Alright, so we only need 400 more. 
screen. YOLO 1000. Oh man. I don't think I'm brave enough to do that. All right. So let's go buy the thing. What's it called? Yes. Star drop. Rare crow. I want that too, though. I don't care about those. Star drop. Yeah. Smiley says, thanks for replying to my comments on YouTube. I try to respond to most comments unless they don't really require a response. Um, <laughs> it's strange, but the taste reminds you of YouTube. Hmm, <laughs> that's odd. I do read them all and I try to respond when I can. There's a lot of comments now, <laughs> like a lot more than when I started, so getting kind of hard to keep up sometimes guys what if I could like oh shit <laughs> there goes all my tokens oh well I don't care I got the thing that's all that matters <clears throat> I guess I could keep playing for the rare crow but eh, I've li I'm like over it unsafe as chicken says star drops after talking about YouTube, the game wants to be part of it. I think it does. Okay, like, stop holding the wheat over your head, weirdo. <clears throat> Alright. Uh, put the jelly back. Put that back. Put that back. Now I gotta, like, figure out where everything went. Grr. Uh. The wheat was in here. There's so many. I really wish I could label these because, or like make them different colors, because I have so much crap. And then I forget. <laughs> okay, those two are in here, I think. Wait. Yeah. Do -do 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 -do. Wait. This one. I think I'll put that. No, I'll just sell those. FK306 says, Hi, sorry I'm late. It's okay. People have been, like, apologizing like crazy. Like, oh, I'm sorry I can't make your streams. It's like, that's okay. You guys have lives. Like, I'm not gonna be upset if you can't come to the stream. Like, it's great if you can, but if you can, I'm not gonna be like, You're not a real fan! I think it's weird to call you fans anyway. That's just weird. I don't know. Where? Oh, right. Right, right, right. I sent, um, my pickaxe is being upgraded right now. I'm like, where's my pickaxe? That's where. It's being upgraded. Ooh, more jellies. Blackberry and blueberry jelly. Like, for a couple days, there were blackberries all over the place. It was really weird. They haven't come back yet. But they, seriously, like, hold on. Is it? See, I have 91 blackberries. That's a little bit ridiculous. <laughs> Just a little bit. I guess I could, like, chop down trees or something. Oh, I gotta go to bed soon, though. I just have all this energy. Oh, yeah, and this thing happened. Like, it fell from the sky or something. I don't, what is that? Oh, I don't think I ever showed you guys this. I have like fruit. They let you pick between fruit and mushrooms. And I have fruit because I hate mushrooms. But there's a lot of creepy bats in here because they're fruit bats. Triple Strike says, so are you ever gonna buy a chicken coop? You should have all the resources for it. Um, I will. I, that's not really my main focus right now. I feel like over the winter I'll probably uh, do some other stuff like that when there's less to do. Right now I'm focusing more on other stuff. Yes, go to sleep. Carrie's Austin says meteorite. You can get some really good materials from them. Oh, do they have like do they 
fall a lot or how's that work? FK306 says, I apologize because I really look forward to your streams, so I get upset at myself when I lose track of time and get distracted. Well, don't ever think that I'm going to be upset <laughs> if you miss a stream because i that's cool. No big deal. I'm surprised anybody comes anyway, so. Alright. So let's get more jellies. Make more jellies. Alright. Um. Got some corn. No! Stop trying to eat the corn! Jeez. Dummy. Alright. Oh, got some grapes. I'm excited for winter because it's so chill in comparison. Like, autumn is really sh stressful, I feel like. So by winter, you're kind of like, yeah, I just want to... I just want to chill. I just want to relax. Know what I mean? Um, I'll have to show you guys the community center because I did a lot with it, actually, which is pretty cool. Um, no, not that one. That's the problem with having all your, like, chests, like, right there. Or next to each other. I don't need to keep that many eggplants. <laughs> I really don't. Um. Mm, I think I'm okay. I'll sell those. Probably keep the sunflower though. Eight days for sunflower seeds. Well, I have enough time to grow them then. Oh, I already have my watering can. Alrighty then. This is sort of like the miscellaneous crops that I just threw. Like, with the weird mystery seeds and or mixed seeds or whatever. I just kind of throw them over here. Alright. Well, missed this one. No! This way. I swear. She never like faces the right direction Smokey the Mudcap says I'm finally here yo hello you didn't miss much we got another was it star drop which is like gives you more energy which is awesome we got that at the Stardew Valley Fair I think is what it's called I feel like that's what it's called I miss this one there was, an, there was an eggplant hiding in there that I couldn't see. Some of these scarecrows say that they haven't encountered any crows, so are they just in a bad position, or am I just not getting many crows? I never really know where to put them. Yams. Yams, yams, yams. Oh, I also have a little bee house now. I got that from the uh, community center. Um, I feel like I should keep the yams because I don't think I don't think I have any saved. So I keep those. Keep the jellies. Sell those. All right. I guess we'll go fishing today. That seems like a good thing to do. It did taste like YouTube, actually. That's like the weirdest thing. You just finished your community center, Carrie's awesome? Holy crap. Uh, Richard, Richard Dang, <laughs> Richard Ang, Richard Dang says, I still need to buy a chicken in my game. It's so much money for them. Yeah, I'm just kind of, like, holding off on that. If you plant flower seeds and don't harvest the flowers, you get flower honey. How's that work? Do you just, like, let let them sit there, or...? 
How does that work? Explain. Share your wisdom while I go trash picking. Oh, wait. I can probably get my pickaxe. It's probably done, thinking about it. I will do that after I trash pick. Smiley says your stars taste like melons. Uh, do you want to you want to clarify that? Looking for a farm fresh bok choy. I would be so happy if someone delivered one. I have that, so I'll give you one. Sarad says, how would you rank each single villager? I mean, we all know Elliot is your favorite, but how does everyone else rank? Am I the only one here that knows nothing about Stardew Valley? <laughs> Lol. That's okay. You don't have to. You don't have to know. My oh, I got some bread. Got some bread out of that trash. Oh, plant the flowers around the bee house. Okay, I'll do that in the future. Um, how would I rank the other single villagers? Let me look. Uh, my favorite, well, you guys know my favorite is Elliot because I feel like he's just so dramatic and he's a novelist, which I can totally just get behind. For those of you who don't know, I actually, um, studied creative writing, so. Uh, I think my second favorite is probably Sam. I just... He seems like a cool dude. He's nice to me. And then probably Sebastian because everyone loves an emo. And then probably Harvey after that and then Alex because Alex is a douchebag. So go away. Go away, Mayor. I want to dig in your trash. <clears throat> Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. Carrie's Awesome said you put over 70 hours into it. Holy crap. Ah, <laughs> Linus. Wait, Bay. No, come back. Come back, Bay. I don't have any jelly for you. Sorry, dear. I really should just, like, keep it in my bag, but... I'm stubborn like that. Hurry up and go inside so I can, like, dig in the trash. Um, okay, so I have the mining carts done because I did that in the community center. So now I can, it can take me to the mines or the bus stop, which is so nice. So amazing. Oh, green algae. I'll take that. Anything in here? Nah, didn't think there would be. Give him the trash bread. <laughs> Captain Quinlan says, what's your favorite girls? Um... Honestly, I don't even really like most of the girls in the game. I just- I don't know why. I just don't. <laughs> uh, let's see. Probably my favorite would be Leah. Even though I'm also in competition with her for Elliot, so it's kind of like a love-hate relationship that we have. And then... Maru, probably. And then... Abigail and Penny are kind of the same. Like, I'm just kind of meh. And then Haley is like, no, I freaking hate you. So, that's pretty much how I'd rank them. She's kind of like the Elise of this game, if you know what I mean. Sylvie says, I'm at 33 hours now, and at year two spring, got the game on Sunday. May have a problem. Holy crap. <laughs> that's crazy. Haley is the worst. I want to throw my potatoes at her face. Um, please do. Also, I now have a steel pickaxe, so go me. Um, I really want to upgrade my watering can during winter if I can, but that might be hard because it's really expensive. It's like 10,000 gold plus, uh, what, five gold bars or something? Which I have, but still. <laughs> Remember to cover your mouth when you sneeze. Okay, Harvey. You and your pedo stash. Throw Linus at Haley, done. <laughs> oh my gosh. <clears throat> Haley actually becomes really nice when you get when you become friends with her probably but she's still like just nasty in general and I don't really appreciate it know what I mean like I did not do anything to deserve your scorn madam da -da -da -da. Ooh. Oh, wow, too. That foraging bonus, though. Smiley says, my stars taste like melons because I put my favorite thing as melons. I love melons and alpacas. Melons are my favorite fruit. Uh-huh. Sure. Captain Quinlan says, Maru is my favorite. 
yeah, she's she's cute and nerdy. I don't know, none of them really like resonated with me. Uh, I kind of like the ones, the girls in the story of seasons better, personally. But again, it's just like a personal choice. Richard Dang says, I'm trying with Maru. It is hard to find out what she likes, though. Uh, can anybody uh, post what Maru likes if they know off the top of their head? Help help a fella out in the chat. That would be nice. I don't know what she likes, uh, or else I would tell you. Um, wow. There's nothing going on here. I put a whole bunch of tapper things on the trees, though. For sap, or pine tar whatever it sounds gross whatever it is oh wow that's a nice mushroom a train is passing through stardew valley is that important because that has happened a few times and i don't really know what that means if it means anything that's a very loud train first of all i need to put bait in here Sylvie says, damn, just realized that you made me buy Story of Seasons and Stardew Valley. Well, what can I say? I am a walking promotion, I guess. Carrie is awesome, says, it drops geodes, wood, and stones. What does? Did I miss something? Oh, the train. Oh, well, how do I get that? chub get that 20 inch chub you know what i'm saying where is the train so he says i now have no life or friends anymore but i have fun you know that's really what matters you don't need friends <laughs> or life you just need fun clearly salmon i think that was my first salmon actually I, ooh, I can probably, is that a community center thing? Maybe. Oh, the train station is where the spot, oh, right, right, right. <laughs> the chub joke made you cringe. You must be new here. There's lots of inappropriate jokes all around. My dog is growling at something. What are you possibly growling at, dog? Nobody's here. I don't feel like running all the way up to the train, though. Does the stuff stay there, or do I have to get there within a certain amount of time? Thank you, Unsavage Chicken. I have gotten a lot better at fishing. I'll say that, and then I will suck horribly. But I've, I've really been trying. Um, I leveled it up a lot. Uh, hold on. Where is it? Skills. Yeah, my fishing is, like, level 5? Yeah. So I don't think that's too bad. And um, I chose the fisher uh, perk, if you want to call it that. So fish are worth 25% more. Oh, you have to actually get there when the train is passing? Well, I'm not going to obviously make that, but that's okay. Fishing, fishing. Oh, no, go up. I want the I want the prize. Come on, come on fish, come on fish, come on fish, come on fish. Ah! The last time I got one of those, it was like, it had so many awesome things in there. There were like three different things and one of them was a diamond. Like, I'm not even kidding. And of course, me being me, I donated it to the museum because I'm just a nice patron. But, I was like, what? It was crazy. Come on, fish. Now! Now! Don't sass me, fish. You don't have the house upgrade either? Neither do I, man. 
Gunther should be a romance option, to be honest. Gunther? I'm trying to think who that is. Who's Gunther? Oh, the museum guy. I can see that. I don't understand why Clint isn't. I feel like... I feel like he should be over Harvey, because Clint isn't married, is he? I don't think so. Maybe he is, I don't know. But if I could marry him and get a discount on him upgrading my tools, I would do it. Just saying. Smiley says, for anyone else interested, Shane loves beer. Well, he needs to wash away his sorrows, so I'm not surprised. Guys, do any of you remember if Salmon is part of the community center? The professional Teddy Roosevelt impersonator? Oh my gosh. When's the next Harvest Moon gonna be up? Uh, you mean Story of Seasons? Is that what you're asking? Asian deity kid? Because I'm not, like, I'm not playing, like, a straight Harvest Moon game right now. Salmon isn't part of it? Damn it, I swear, every fish I catch is not part of the freaking community center. Wait, you can check the community center in your items menu? You can? What? Th I wish somebody would have told me that a long time ago, man. Oh my gosh, how did I not know that? Man, you know what? That would have saved me so many freaking trips to the damn community center. Alright, hold on. Oh my god, <laughs> why? Why did I not know of this? Okay. Ugh. <laughs> so many regrets. Anyway, I'll show you the community center. So, I'm really close to, for the dye bundle. Like, I have four out of six things. I just need red cabbage and a duck feather. Um, the chef's bundle, I ain't got nothing. Nothing for that one. And then I put the wheat in the fodder thing. I don't know how to get hay out of my silo, though. So, I can't really do that. So, if anybody knows that, that would be great. Um, oh, man. I think I have an extra purple mushroom. I could probably put that in there. Uh, I really need to get another frozen geode because I kept forgetting that I needed to put one in there. I'm not sure where to get the Nautilus shell. I got nothing here, unfortunately. Where where am I going to get a rabbit's foot? Do I have to get, like, a pet rabbit and then cut its foot off or something? Like, what the heck? I haven't done any of these either just because money. Um, let's see. Yeah. Frustrating. Tiger trout. Didn't I get... Oh, okay. Which one am I missing? Oh, catfish. Sadness. I'm missing, like, all of these, except the ghost fish. I have never caught any of these, by the way. Like, I just... I'm having really crappy luck, I guess. Anyway. Uh, so I did a lot in the crafts room. As you can see. So I got like most of the foraging bundles done. Obviously I it's not winter yet, so I can't finish that, but soon I will finish that. And then we also need one more thing for the exotic foraging bundle, which is pretty cool. So I'll have to find like one of these things. I'm hoping that I can just get maple syrup, because I feel like that would be the easiest out of all of those. Ooh, quality crops. Yeah, I don't... I'm working on corn, but... Unfortunately, I didn't save five of each of those. I have no animals, so we, we don't have anything going on there yet. But I have a couple things going on in the artisan bundle. I'll just take a little while. I can get honey eventually, because I have bees now, so... Um, Unsaved Chicken says, gonna take off... I'll see you later. Thanks for stopping by. FK306 says, Ooh, Keita, I've been having three-a-day, three-day Justice League marathon and have watched episode 1 to 24. Ah, memories. Aw. I love that show. It's amazing. 
just click on the silo or did they remove that? I clicked on it and it told me like how many I had, but I didn't know I could pull out of it. Can you only get it when you have a coop? Like that's what I'm confused about. I, yeah, I have some pomegranates in there. I haven't decided if I want to put them, if I want to use them yet or not. Also, you can cheese the game by putting all your hay from your silo into a chest. That is useful. Yes, the eel is night fishing. Zextra says, oh yes, key to stream, I need this. I kind of needed this too. I was not in a good mood earlier, so streaming, streaming helps. Um, okay, so I'm going to try to get some of the hay out of there. Because you guys said just click on it. Maybe it's just because I was right clicking, maybe? I don't know. Let's go see. Let's go see. Because if I can just put it all in a chest, I would do that. That is a fish. That That is fishing. We don't want that. See, every time I click on it, it says piece of hay. Like, I can't... My Am I doing it wrong? Help. <laughs> Someone help. Yeah, I can't get it out of there. Ooh, speaking of honey, hello. Thanks, little bee friends. Buzz buzz. Alright, we got some trash, which is good. Put that in the recycling thingy. Um, I'll probably keep a salmon. In here and hmm bream do I have a bream in here I like hoarding stuff because then when somebody asks for something in the uh, on the bulletin board then it's like oh I have that they must have removed it you could buy some from Marnie for the quest I could do that Oh, you didn't hear what I said, FK306. I said, the Justice League is awesome, and I'm glad that you're enjoying it. Or something to that effect. Probably not those words exactly, but... Roughly. Roughly what I said. The show is so amazing. Um... I guess I will sell most of the fish. I have, wow, I had a lot of chubs. I did not realize that. All right, sell that, I guess. Um, I guess I'll keep that. So much crap, so much crap in my inventory. Um, not what I wanted. Harvey wanted a bok choy. I need to not forget that, because that's important. Um, put the bread in there. Put those in there. Honey, I'll probably take to the community center tomorrow. And the rest is just garbage. Pretty much. So. Well, we had a good day fishing, I would say. I think we did pretty good. Wouldn't you guys agree? Pat myself on the back there. I've gotten so much better at fishing. Oh, I got an awesome sword. I forgot to tell you guys. It's an obsidian sword. I think I got it when I reached level 90 of the mines, which I did off screen. Um, Zextra says, I applied for a job, got called for an interview today, and learned the job is from 6 a.m. to 6 p.m., six days a week, with constant intense hard labor, outdoors in all weather conditions, and I may get hired. This sucks. <laughs> well, you could not take the job i mean i know maybe you like really need it so uh but it's not i mean it's not worth like if it's gonna kill you it's not worth it fk306 says as soon as you build a cooper barn you can grab the necessary hay at least that's how i did it okay um 360k a year j just for that really that's that's not a lot for those hours. <laughs> like, that's... That's a lot of hours for that salary. Oh, 
Oh, I have a pumpkin. I saw it. Alright. I have so much refined quartz. Ah, from all my garbage. See, it pays to collect garbage. So. Do you guys know how often the, um, the bees give you honey? Does anybody know? Pumpkin. Hmm. All the cranberries. No. Stop eating it. Thank you for the follow. I really appreciate it. I have like over a hundred followers now. It's kind of crazy. It's kind of crazy. Didn't really expect that. Ah! Always, 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 always. So many cranberries. See, I'm hoarding them and then I'm just gonna keep making jelly over winter so that I can keep making the muns. The muns! Right. No, not in there. Sell that eggplant. I guess I'll keep the pumpkin. Because I think I put the other one in the community center, so I should probably keep that one. Okay. What do you guys want to do today? We need to swing by the community center and drop the honey off. And we need to give Harvey a bok choy. Bok choy. Where is it? Yeah. So, Arietta the Wild says, Hello, Kita. I had a nightmare, so now I'm awake at 3 in the morning, so I thought, why not check your stream out? Well, I'm really sorry that you had a nightmare. I hope this, uh, this is nice and chill for you. Hopefully there won't be many nightmares. I don't know if I want to go mining yet today. Thank you for the follow. Appreciate it. I vaguely heard Crash Bandicoot dancing in the corner. No! Yeah, I don't know if I want to go mining today. Hmm. I guess we could forage or something. Oh my gosh, all the follows. Thank you guys. Lots and lots of follows. There's like a lot of people here too. Like 30 of you. It's crazy. Oh, I thought that was ready to be picked. How are you not ready to be picked? <sighs> I am so excited for winter. Just mine and fish and chill, prepare, make my fields look less like crap. I mean, they don't look too bad right now, but they need to look better. And I need to make better use of my sprinklers. We'll do that in the future. Okay. So we need to find Harv Harv. Is he- he's the doctor, right? I think he's a doctor. Oh yeah, here's my awesome sword. It is pretty amazing. I know, I know. So awesome. Um, hmm. I guess we'll forage then. Carrie's awesome says minimum wage in the UK full time working would be like 15k. Yeah, it's probably it's probably different. Mirak Spectac says, I already subbed on YouTube, just never came over to Twitch to follow. Well, thank you for the follow. It's awesome. Also, minimum wage doesn't really cut it once you get to a certain point into adulthood. Like, it really doesn't, especially when you factor in healthcare and all that other fun, grown up y stuff. So, because the UK has better health care than we do. <laughs> At least from what I've heard. Alright, doctor. 
You want your bok choy? No, you can't. Where's the doctor? Oh, there he is. Hey, here's your thing. Yes, I saw your ad. Thank you. Delivery, 240. Awesome. Oh, it makes him happy. Well, that's just a bonus. Like, he has such a pedo stash. If he would just shave it, I think he would be a little bit more attractive. Probably not, but maybe. Digging in the trash. Ooh, more bread. Why are they just throwing out the, it's like, Olive Garden breadsticks? Is that what they're throwing away? Who would ever throw those away? Crazy person. Yeah, I mean, healthcare obviously isn't, like, completely free or anything, but... It's still pretty crazy when you think of all the expenses that we pay for it. Mirax Tech says, didn't he not have a stash in earlier releases? I don't know. I thought he always had one. I could be wrong. Gotta put some bait in my crab trap. Um, let's go fishing, I guess. For a little bit. We gotta go to the community center. Trash bread. Give Haley the trash bread. Are you nuts? I'm not giving Haley crap. I don't care about being her friend. <laughs> also, the trash bread gives you like 50... I think it was 50 stamina. And anytime I find sardine that I might need for the community center um anytime there's like cooked food I always keep it because it usually gives you decent energy and health so then I take it into the mine with me Sylvie says everybody has better health care than the US <laughs> ah Anchovies! Anchovies! Anybody remember that really, really old episode of Spongebob? That might have been in the pilot, actually. Yeah, 200 bucks doesn't really pay for much. Like, even if you're making 200 a week, it's really not enough. Like, my student loans are... would be more than that. But I have... I paid some of them off. I'm, like, not even making that right now because my hours are shit right now. Oh, thank you for the follow! Oh, I, um, I took that off. I told Nightbot to back off with the links so that people can post them. Um, unless it gets out of hand, I'll let it go. I don't think I really need to worry about it. It's just, like, you don't want people being, like, advertising themselves. You know what I mean? So I think that's why it's, like, automatically set to, um, not allow links. But until there's a problem, I think I'll just let it go. So many sardines, man. Serata pays for like two Nintendo games and two dis DLCs. At least that's how I, I measure. <laughs> yeah. I know what you mean. Another anchovy. Oh wow. Harvey used to not have one. That's kind of funny. I'll have to look at that then. You can get... Oh, okay. Charge up the fishing bar to near full, then go for the chest. You should have enough time to return for the fish. Oh. Interesting. I'm always, like, just terrified of losing the fish. But that makes sense. Do you... You still get the treasure chest, even if you don't catch the fish, right? Or did I make that up in my brain? Hmm. 
Yeah, FK through six is in the hard way not to link. I told Nightbot to chill out. I think just for like larger streams, it can become a serious issue. And obviously, my stream is not <laughs> enormous. But. You need to catch the fish? Okay. Zextra says, yeah, if I get the job, I probably won't be around much, but I'll try and stop by when I can. Well, you gotta do what you gotta do, man. I was just really happy that people were not upset when I started putting ads on my videos. Like, I haven't made much. I think uh, I made, like, 60 bucks so far last month. But, uh, hey, it's 60 bucks I didn't have before, and that'll pay for a game. So, that is... I am more than happy with that. I just could really use it because uh, I haven't been getting many hours at work. I don't know what is going on. It's a weird situation. But. Mirak Spectac says, I don't know, I rarely fish because it's annoying I'm pretty bad at it. I was too. I was really, really bad. Um... But I just kind of kept at it, and just kind of, um, Willie is creeping me out. What is he doing? He's, like, up my butt right now. Oh, you're trying to show me up with your fishing skills? What in the heck? Hi. What are you doing? <laughs> what a strange, that was so weird. Sexter says, yeah, YouTubers really cut with their paying YouTubers. Yeah. I mean, I don't have a lot of, uh, of views to really make a lot anyway, but I'm with Curse, and they're probably one of the better networks to be with if you're small because they only take 10%. Other networks, I've heard, will take, like, 35%, and that's after YouTube's cut, because YouTube takes 45%. So, like, right there, you only get 55% anyway. Ooh, that looks inappropriate. But yeah, YouTube takes 45%, so you're already left with 55% of what you earn. And then your network will take, an, you know, a chunk of that. So Curse only takes 10%, which is one of the reasons why I'm with them. Also, there's no contract, so I can leave whenever I want. Other other people I know have, had, have been locked into two-year contracts, and that's a long time. Albacore! So I didn't want to do that, and that's, like, one of the big reasons why I went with Curse. Willie, the name says it all. So true. Smiley says, as great as it seems to pay to YouTube, some YouTubers I know are stuck to work 24-7 all year. Yeah, it's, like, I, as awesome as it would be to have YouTube as a full-time job, at the same time, I don't think people realize how long it takes. Like, you're working more than 40 hours a week if you're doing it full-time. Like, for example, Phoenix Wright videos are usually... I don't know, an hour, an hour and a half. So you have usually that long, plus I would say anywhere from 15 minutes to a half an hour of stuff that has to be cut out. So already the recording is probably two hours long. Then you have to edit it, so that's like another two hours to edit the whole thing. And then you have to upload it and all that stuff. Like It takes a long time. So, I think, I don't think people always, like, realize how much it takes. Because a lot of people are like, oh, it's just YouTube. Like, why do you get paid to do that? And it's like, well, it's actually, it's actually a decent amount of work. Believe it or not. So, it's kind of like why you can't really, you can't or you shouldn't do it for the money. Because, honestly, <laughs> like... Uh, it's, you're probably never going to be making that much money. Silly, six hours of work and still people are bitching about it. Yeah, it's, it's a lot. There's a gold spot by the big rock where you are now. I don't know what that means. There's a gold spot. What is a gold spot? I'm, like, so confused. 
Mirax Spectex says, you select Curse for their League of Legends team, if that's worth anything. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I haven't had any issues with them so far. Um, I haven't gotten paid yet because, just because, like, I started uh, partway through, like, the pay period, so I won't get paid until May, but that's okay. Not a problem. Uh, Mirax Spectex says, it was when you were fishing, but I'm not sure what a gold spot is either. Was that where the bubbles were? Is that what you mean? Because I've heard that... Oh, gold star fishes. Okay, so that was probably where the bubbles were. Gotcha. Yeah, that would make sense. I got, I got a lot of uh, silver starred fishes, though, so that's good. be happy to sell them and I'm happy that I was able to put one in the freaking community center man fk306 says I know I wouldn't be able to do YouTube as a career I always admire youtubers for the hard work and try to watch the whole ad unless it's 20 minutes long that happens way too often it's insane how the ad is sometimes longer than the video itself yeah I I think I have those disabled I can't remember there's like six different types of ads you can have on your videos and obviously they recommend that you put all of them but I think I disabled the really long ones just because I was like, that's a little too long to ask people to watch, but I don't remember. And then I think I have the ones that are like in the middle of the video. I don't know if you've noticed, but in some videos, like it'll stop halfway to have an ad and that annoys me personally. So I disabled those as well just because like that pisses me off. <laughs> So, no, I must put the Olive Garden breadstick. Okay, there we go. Oh, geez. Negative 35 energy. Wow. I thought it would give me. I thought it was like the same, but I guess not. Is this. Will this ever show up in the community center? I'll, I'll just save it. Just in case. That's weird. That is quite weird. But. Whatever. I guess I'll sell all this crap. And I think tomorrow we'll go mining, actually. I think that would be a good idea. So I can show you how far I got in the mine. Off screen. So much fish. Have some. Have some trash. Pushing Daisy says, Gold spot is a fishing spot where you always get gold star fishes. And I meant when you were fishing. Okay, gotcha, gotcha. Thank you for that. Captain Quinlan says, I, my birthday is in like a month. No one cares. No, I'm just kidding. Everyone say happy early birthday to Quinlan. She's turning 16. What an old woman. Oh my goodness. Olive Garden breadstick. Damn, now I'm hungry. Man, those breadsticks. I could just eat a meal of those breadsticks. They're so delicious. Your expect tech says, hey, load it up with ads. I think more, more, most people are used to it by now. Yeah, I was surprised. I was kind of expecting more people to be like, you're so out. <laughs> but nobody was. Everybody was really supportive. So that was really awesome of you guys because... Hey, 60 bucks is 60 bucks, man. I bought a new microphone and it was really expensive, so paying that off little by little. Level 6 fishing. Yes. Fishing rod proficiency, new crafting recipe spinner. Ooh. And a new crafting recipe trap bobber. That sounds inappropriate, but let's figure out what it does. I just bought my mic stand. Don't do that. FK306 says, wow, 16, so young. I'm turning, uh, I'm 25 turning 26 this year. <laughs> yeah, she's a little babby. Little babby. Merrick Spectex says, I'm pretty surprised you didn't instantly monetize. Like, I have 15 views of my vids and they're monetized. I was very scared to monetize my videos, to be honest. Like, the main reason I started monetizing was because I was like, I'm fucking poor. <laughs> so... I didn't want people to be turned away before they actually saw my content, I guess. Know what I mean? So that was kind of like why I didn't do it right away. 
Nothing against people who do. I was just like, ah, this is a big step. My life. Freak out. Because that's what I do. Um, I love how I get torches out of that. Like, really? <sighs> so weird. Alright, what's my letter? Kita, I'd like to buy a pumpkin from you. My daughter and I want to carve a jack-o'-lantern for the upcoming Spirits Eve Festival. Oh, I have a pumpkin. See, this is why I hoard. Which one's Caroline? Uh, Caroline, what do you look like? Woman... Where you be? Are you the one with green hair? Yes. Okay. So I'll have to bring her a pumpkin. I think it's cute that they do like a Halloween type festival because a lot of the, um, at least pretty much all the Harvest Moon games I've played, they've never really done that. At least that I can remember. Do any of you guys know any uh, Harvest Moon games that celebrate Halloween? Because <clears throat> I can't think of any. So many crops. No, no, why must you always water the wrong crops? Every day of my life. Um, well, while I'm watering crops and not really doing anything interesting, I might be streaming this weekend, possibly. Again, if there's time. Because I know a bunch of you, well, you guys probably aren't here but I know a bunch of my like UK followers and people that are not in the US get sad because they can't watch streams from US people just because like the time difference so I might try to stream this weekend earlier like I did last weekend we'll have to see I will let you guys know via Twitter and Facebook and all that jazz if I decide to. I don't know what I want to play though. That is the problem. Always the problem. I kind of want to play something on the N64. I don't know. Kind of have that itch to do that. Let's see. No, don't water that. What are you doing, crazy? Crazy. Can I... Yes, I can do a pickled artichoke. Okay, I'll do that. Let's see. That. I don't need those torches. Play Harvest Moon 64. <laughs> Someday I would actually really like to do that, but that's something I would probably do a full Let's Play of. I don't know. Zextra says, so far it's Richard. It's Richard. I must have missed something in the chat. Oh yeah, there was something in um, Friends of Mineral Town where you gave candy to kids. Right. I don't think it was in fall though, was it? <laughs> Silly, you're from Belgium? That's really cool. That's 2 a.m. Oh my gosh. That's crazy. Yeah, I don't really sleep either, to be honest. I've never played Harvest Moon 64. It's weird because I had an N64, but I only had Harvest Moon for um, PlayStation because my friend had it and she kind of introduced me to it. So that was basically why I got it. Um, so I actually never played it, but I've always wanted to. 28 field snacks. <laughs> I think we're good. FK306 says, I tried to be there, but my nephew wanted to play hide and seek at the worst time. And I had to pretend I couldn't find him. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Zexter says, wait, Kita said she's like 80, right? She's the eldest. Yes, I am 85. So, I am the oldest. You all have to listen to me. Wild plum. Well, look at that. Oh wait, I can just... I can just take my little mine car to the mines. Look at that. I should probably go in the hot spring. But still, fast travel is the best. Arietta the Wild says it's three right here in Finland. Holy crap. It's crazy how you guys are like so far away. 
I'm always amazed when there are so many people that watch from like Germany or Finland or wherever you guys are. You sound so young though. Yes, don't you wish that you sounded this young at 85? I don't know, somebody somebody in the one stream said I was a vampire, so maybe that's why. 85, but I just look much younger. Why is everybody having a party when I leave? That's rude. And Succubus Demon is in Denmark, wow. Crazy. That's kind of why I would like to have um, a stream where people can come that are not, like, that normally can't because of the time difference. But I don't, like I said, I don't know, I don't know what to play. I kind of want to play one of my old games that I had as a kid, the N64, like, just for nostalgia. Just kind of like a one-shot. I would also really like to do Mario Party, like, the original ones. Because they're amazing. I just don't know if Nintendo would be, like, jerks about it. It's r it's really old, though, so... I don't know. Because I have to think about, you know, when I upload them to YouTube, like, is there going to be a problem? But I might just try it and see if I can get away with it, and then... <laughs> and then go from there. Oh, and now I'm- now I smoke cigars? What is going on here? I'm an assassin. The first rule of Assassin's Cult, you don't talk about the Assassin's Cult. I've gone from vampire- alright, alright, I'm going to the train, I'm going to the train. Can I make it? Like, will I get something? I'm going. Going. So, I've gone from like- I was 75 last stream? Yeah, I know, I aged 10 years since last stream, it's crazy. I've gone from being a vampire to like, okay, drop stuff for me. Could it run me over? Some nice graffiti on the train. Like, what am I supposed to do? Ah, oh, hello. Free crap, keep dropping stuff. Keep firing, assholes. Don't hurt yourself by the train, like Chloe. Don't attack the train. Okay. That sounds ominous. What is this? This is horrifying. That's like the moon from Majora's Mask's, like, creepy cousin. He knows something. Psychibus Demon says, I don't care for the time difference. Mostly I sleep at this time because of studies, but I have this week semi-off. Well, that's nice. It's always good to have a week off. I can't believe I ran all the way back here for a freaking geode. Like, really? Aria of the Wild says, I get the vampire thing too, since I'm so pale that people think I'm dying or dead, I guess. Yeah, I'm really pale too. Hi, green sparky boy. <laughs> the train has a face. Is it Thomas? I think it's an evil Thomas. Honestly. You got stuck by the train and got killed? Oh man, that would suck. Alright, so look at my skills. I got to level 105. Aren't you guys impressed? You guys should be so impressed. By my skills as I now probably die oh goodness no you have no chance to do your weird voodoo shit I'm not giving you a chance and you need to stop jumping at me jerk okay oh man I forgot to give Caroline the pumpkin oh well does anybody know if Caroline goes to the pub at night so I could probably catch her there Ah! Get out of here. I'm cutting off all his legs. It just seems horrible. Oh, there we go. One floor down. I'll just take this gold. I actually have a good bit of gold. Or at least, I think it's all mostly gold bars now. Oh gosh, these creepy things. Holy crap, what are you? What, what are you though? No! Get out of here! You're scary. Strange bun. I love how they like drop a strange bun. And like, I can eat that. Oh my gosh. There's another one. Also a bat. 
All right. Nope. No, no ritual for you. Get out of here. He dropped a copper bar? That's strange. How many floors to go? Uh, there's 120. So 15 floors from there. Ooh, Omni Geode. Those are always fun. All right. Can't. I'm not going this way. No. Get away, bat. Get away, bat. <laughs> Get away! Never catch me, bat. Oh, good. There's purple mushroom. I need that for the thing. Community center. Take it. Is my inventory full? Oh my gosh, my inventory's full. What the crap? You know what? Get out of here, bat. Alright. Let's see. Sap. I don't need that crap. So, I will take the mushroom. She is a TARDIS. So, I figured out that it lags only when I'm looking at the video of you playing, but if I open another tab and do stuff, it won't lag, and I can hear what you say. That's weird. Your computer is strange. Quick, bomb something. I always forget to bring bombs. Like, every day. It's a problem. Kita, what do you like to eat? Like, as a... As a person? Or, like... In the... In a game? Or do you mean, like, me? Ooh, this ladder is already here. Can I get it? Ha! Sucker. Sucker. Um... What do I want to get rid of? I could probably eat this cave carrot. It'll give me a little bit. I need to preserve the pumpkin. I'll eat the cave carrot. And then I can pick up this. Alright, eat it. As in me. Um, I am a really picky eater. Like, it's a serious problem. I don't know... Dang it! I don't know if I'm more sensitive to taste than other people or what, but I am very, very picky. So, my favorite food is probably mac and cheese, but it has to be done right. I don't like it baked. I don't like it with the crumbly things on top that's just like ruins mac and cheese. It has to be like creamy mac and cheese. So that's probably like my favorite thing. You piece of crap. Oh, well, thanks for... Thanks for that. Ooh, what is it? What is it? What is it? Space boots? What? I want the space boots. Here, we'll drop... We'll drop the iron ore for right now, and I'll put on the space boots. I'm so excited, man. Space boots? Um... I guess I'll just get rid of the coal. Look at my cute little boots! They're adorable. Awesome. Alright, let's keep going. I don't know if I can make it before the end of the night, but we'll try. Mac and cheese is a very difficult dish to master. Yes, it is. There's, like, a specific way of doing it. That is definitely better. That's, like, one of my favorite things. Um... What other food do I eat? Nothing. I like cheese in general. <laughs> A lot of times I just snack on cheese. Um, I like subs. Usually a good bet. Obviously it depends on what's in the sub, but like turkey or chicken. It's usually what I go for. Uh, get out of here. And you can get out of here too, bat. This sword is amazing. I love it. <laughs> Merrick Spectex says, I don't think anyone has, has impressed me with their mac and cheese. I have to make it myself. Yeah, I... There, my aunt gave me a really good recipe for mac and cheese in the crock pot. And it's so good. So delicious. 
Oh, friendly gaming. Thank you for the follow. Really appreciate that. Do you like aged cheese? I don't know if I've ever had aged cheese. I don't know. I like I like more mild cheese. I'm kind of picky. I'm even picky about the things that I actually like. Um I'm trying to think of like what crap I can actually throw away. Um I like the bat wings away. I don't really need them. Cheese. I only have one copper ore, so I'll throw that away. So much stuff. Oh my. Get out of here, slimes. I'm just trying. Oh no. Oh. Okay, made it. Hold on. I want to eat this hazelnut. Actually, eat that. Actually, you should probably eat this one too. Captain Quinlan, yes, your mom's recipe is actually quite good. Get out of here, freak. Oh my gosh. I'm gonna freaking murder you. And everyone you've ever loved. Oh crap. Getting late. Gotta go. I'm not taking chances. This is like the best thing ever. Freaking the minecart. It's amazing. Mirax Spectac says, Pass down recipes are always the best. Got a few Italian recipes from a few generations back in Italy, naturally. Ooh, wow. That'd be pretty cool. Uh, my great-grandmother also made the best chicken pot pie ever. It was so amazing. Even though we say chicken pot pie and you're probably thinking of something totally different than what I'm thinking of. Um... Lots of crap today. Lots of void essence. Wait, that doesn't go in there anymore. Um. Alright. I think we're good. Wait, gotta put the bomb in there. Okay. Not what I wanted. Okay, so stones are gonna go in there. Whoops. That goes in there. Not in there. Just kidding. Actually goes in there. Why does the purple mushroom have to have a star? I was gonna put it in the thing. And now it's got me questioning it because... Where are my other pomegranates? Oh. Oh wait. No, that's wild plum. Well, frick. That goes in there. See, this is the problem with having like five million things. Everything has to go in the right place, and if it doesn't, it's gonna bother me. Yes, I know you wanna go to sleep. Shut up. Deal with it. Alright. Okay. Okay, we're good. Now I can go to sleep. Area of the Wild says, I wish I could eat what I want, but allergies and celiac disease? I don't know if I'm saying that right. I'm sorry. I, I've never actually heard of that. But any any disease in which you have to, like, restrict yourself with eating is horrible. Because, like, I don't know. I would probably die. Like, if I had, if I had some kind of, like, even lactose intolerance, I feel like I would die. <laughs> I would not be able to eat anything. Real chicken pot pie is like what other people think of as chicken and dumplings. That's kind of like our pot pie. We think of chicken pot pie as that. And then your version of chicken pot pie is like what we think of as chicken pie. Like with a crust. If that makes sense. It's very important distinction, so... Get it right. Okay. So. We're gonna have to take these to the dude. 
And we're gonna have to deliver the pumpkin today. And holy crap, that gives a lot of energy. Like, I don't want to give it to... I don't want to give it to the community center anymore. I want to keep it. Don't I have another one? Not in there. Oh yeah, I have another one. See, we're good. See, this is why I hoard. This is why I hoard. Alright. All the grapes. All the grapes. No, don't. Why you gotta water the ground? Why you gotta do that? Did I tell you to do that? No. I don't want you to water the ground. It's kind of impractical. I mean... Again. Impractical. Stop. Stop doing it. Stop doing it! Ugh! Well, you know, I wouldn't have to go over here and get a ton of water if you would water things properly. Just saying. No! Every day, I fight with my character about watering. Every day. She never learns. Alright. Arctic Snail, hi! How are you? Oh, okay, Arietta. That means you can't have gluten. That would be really hard. Like I said, I would probably just die. I would probably just give up because like there are so many foods that I can't eat anyway. Like I just can't. If something smells a certain way, like I can't actually force it. I don't know. I get really disgusted by food really easily. It's kind of, it's weird. I don't know. It's just a thing. Um, I can sell those. I'll keep the grapes. I guess. For some jellies. Oh, wait, I'd probably take two of those, actually. Artichoke I should probably keep, because I don't think I have many. So I'll have to keep that one. Alright. What is this? Come by the shop and check out the new rods I'm selling. They're the best money can buy, and you can customize them with different kinds of tackle. Hope to see you soon. I don't want to hear about your rods, Willie. It's inappropriate. So inappropriate. I'll probably go over there. Um, yeah, because I think I have a new crafting recipe with that. The spinner. It increases the bite rate when fishing. I hope those don't break. Like, if you make it once, does it... I don't know. I don't know how that works. Slime egg press? Compresses 100 pieces of slime into a slime egg. Why? Why would I want that? That sounds gross. That sounds, like, really gross. No, don't eat it. Put it in the thing. Okay. So, we need to find what's her face. We okay. We need to find Caroline. Where the heck does she live? Caroline. Oh, she's Pierre's wife? Didn't know that. Angry Chieftain. Oh man, finally caught one of your streams. Aw. Glad to have you here. You should pay Robert a visit and see all the buildings she can build for you. Is that like the slime thing? Like, cause there was a slime thing that she could build. Trying to keep the art of fishing alive, I'll pay 400 G to any fishing enthusiast who catch two catfish. Dude, I can't even get one catfish for the community center, so you're on your own, dude. Caroline. Hey. Hey. I have stuff for you. Are you here? Oh, Angry Chieftain, thanks for the follow. Alright, here is the pumpkin that I owed to you. Give me money. Abigail will be so happy when she sees it. She's right there. She's she's right... She's, she probably saw it. Unless she, like, hid it in your pants. Alright, 500. Oh yeah, I still have to find Linus's blackberry basket. <laughs> Does anybody know where that is? Because I have not come across it yet. It's 
Smiley says, my mom makes awesome chili. My dad makes awesome barbecue pizza and steak. That's cool. I don't... I don't really have a lot of those kinds of memories with my parents. My mom was an okay cook, but uh, we just didn't see eye to eye on things, so I didn't often eat her food. When you're at the bus stop, go to the tunnel to the left. There's a tunnel? What? What? Hey, get out of here. I gotta talk to Cliffy. Clinty. His name's Clint, not Cliff. Clinty. You know who I'm saying. This handsome... This handsome gent right here. Big sight. Wow. I love how those really nice, like, Omni Geodes give me shit. They give me nothing. Smiley says, my mom had to learn to cook because she became sort of a mom as the oldest child in her family. That's rough. So many kids have to grow up fast. And it is unfortunate. Smiley says, my dad grew up with four sisters. I taught him to cook, make up, do hair, etc. Haha. <laughs> He sounds like a catch. Any man who's not too proud to do someone's hair. Community center. Smiley says the roughest part is that her mom was a stay at home mom but did nothing. Wow. I, uh, know how you feel. My mom was kind of a stay-at-home mom, if you wanna. By that you mean she was, like, drunk all the time. Not all the time, sometimes she was high, you know. Change it up. Sometimes she was both. Alright, where is that... Purple mushroom one. Angela Manasai, am I very late? Um, not super late. Like, I think I've been going since 7, so. Just been kind of hanging out. I always post the streams on YouTube, so if you want to watch the whole thing, feel free. What? There was one that needed. There was one that needed a purple mushroom, I swear. What the heck? Did I? No, I thought there was another one though. What? What? You know what? I'm gonna punch you in the face. Game. Oh, I think it's a bulletin board. Maybe. Yeah, there it is. Bulletin board! I always forget about it. Because it's like... Off to the side. Arctic Snail says, What the fuck? Your mom doesn't sound like a good mother. Yeah, she's not. <laughs> not at all. Actually. She keeps writing me from prison. It's kind of annoying. Like, I wish she would stop doing that. Because, <laughs> like... I'm really getting sick and tired of it. Silly <laughs> says, My mom's just plain evil, so I'd rather have her drink a bit to calm the F down. Yeah. Uh, it's... It sucks. Arctic Snail says, What the fuck is with all the messed up family lives? I think a lot of people have, like, really messed up families. What is that? Oh, haha, <laughs> thank you. Thank you, person. I forget who it was, but thank you for telling me where the berry basket was. I would have never found that back there. I was, like, looking over by the actual, uh, by Marnie's place, 
Like, that's where I thought it would be because there were a ton of blackberries over there. <sighs> so, now I gotta find Linus. Oh, collect my muns. Alright, Linus, let's go. Angry Chieftain, talk about the first stream experience. <laughs> yeah. I haven't really uh, talked much about my mom. I have a lot of stories that I think are funny. Other people would probably be like, that's horrifying, but I think it's funny. <laughs> I've just been, like, debating telling them. I mean, it's not slander. Like, it happened. And we don't have the same last name or anything, so it's not like her identity could be found. Linus. Linus, where are you at, boy? I need to give you your brewery basket. Thank you, Silly. Right of the Wild says, I'm so sorry to hear that my mom is wonderful, even though she's very ill. Oh. Well, appreciate her because... Thank you, Cracking Knuckles. For the follow. But definitely appreciate, like, if you have good parents, like, seriously. Even if they piss you off. Appreciate them because there are a lot of people that don't. The worst part is, like, in her letter, she's like, why do you hate me? And I'm like, I how, do, how do you not understand that? I have not spoken to her in six years. Like, literally nothing. Not a letter, nothing. Because I just kind of had it, you know? It's like, I'm done with you. Like, I just can't take it anymore. And, uh, so she keeps writing me from prison. And I'm just like, please stop doing that. I really don't want you to keep doing that. Wild honey. Oh, right. I wanted to go buy a new fishing rod. Well, depending on how much they are. Sylvia says, if you have good parents, love them because there are people who are not at all made to be parents. That is true. Veronica Celeste says, ah, my parents' story is that I got adopted for my 18th birthday this year. What? <laughs> good lord. Cracking knuckles. I hope you're enjoying the game. The stream got a little real. Uh, <laughs> we were talking about the game and then like, everybody was like, my parents suck. Well, my parents suck too. And then it just kind of went from there. Marnie, go away. Angry Chieftain says, I don't know, mom, you're kind of in jail right now. <laughs> I don't bother responding. She, she has issues. And like, if you respond, you're just going to fuel the fire. You know what I mean? Like, she's the type of person that you can argue with for 10 hours straight and get nowhere. She just, she just doesn't get it, you know? Like, it's never her fault. It's always someone else's fault. So, I just got tired of it. And I was like, okay. Goodbye. I am tired of your crap. At least she's not calling, because she used to, like... The other times that she was in jail, she would, like, call, collect. <laughs> I'm like, can you not do that either? Please? <laughs> Silly says, I first thought that I had mommy issues and it was all teen problems, but I'm 25 now and nope, still a bitch. <laughs> yeah. Uh, unfortunately, sometimes that's the way it is. I was going to buy a fishing rod and then I was like, forgot that I was doing that, but oh well. It's a little late now. Let's go see if Linus is home. I want to give you your freaking basket. It's in my inventory, dude. Veronica Celeste says, I'm sorry about your mom. It's okay. Like, I'm I'm over it. I mean, she wasn't really much in my life. Like, she just kind of came back whenever she felt like it and just custody crap. And so, I mean, it's not like I had to live with her. I only lived with her a little bit uh, during my lifetime. The rest of it was, like, forced visitation. So, it could have been a lot worse than it was. Dr. Rain says, what are mommy and daddy issues? Uh, I don't really know. Oh, hello, Linus. That's really creepy. Here you go. I'm glad that you uh, 
liked your basket. Okay. Um, mommy daddy issues are kind of like <laughs> uh, emotional scars that you have because your parents suck. And it affects you later in life. <laughs> Sylvie says, Mommy daddy issues is when your mom or dad fucks you up. Yeah, pretty much. Cracking Knuckle says, My father left when I was one year old. He even tried to choke me because of my colic before he walked out the door. Wow, what a nice fellow. There are some fucked up people in the world. It surprises me every day. Like, how are. I just. I don't understand how some of these people are just in existence. Super K Brown says you're a strong person. Thank you. I try. But I don't know if you guys have ever heard on other streams or videos when I say I don't drink and that's why. Because when you've seen someone basically lose everything and just kind of like alcohol is their life and like they've had more DUIs than you can count <laughs> like it, it just turned me away from it also drugs obviously cause holy crap lots of drugs <laughs> we're in the house Triple strike is correct. That is a meteor. Captain Quinlan says, hashtag deep stream. Yeah, this is, this is gonna be a chill stream and then everyone's like, my life is terrible. <laughs> yeah, it really sucks when, uh, when you realize just how many people have like messed up families. That's why I say go make your own family. Surround yourself with people you want to be around, not people you feel obligated to be around. That's how I look at it anyway. Because I've had a lot better friends in life than family. I mean, not true in all cases, but in some. Captain Quinlan says, don't drink children, it's bad for you? I missed something there. <laughs> Sarah says, I've never had issues with my parents, but I still have issues with my sister, who's almost an adult. Yeah, sibling issues can happen. I haven't really had that problem, luckily. Oh, uh... Someone, I can't see like, oh, Super K Brown says, are you and Batman going to have a family? A bat family? Um, we have three dogs and that's enough for me. I don't, I don't really want to have kids for a lot of reasons. I just, I don't know. <laughs> After my mom being the way she was, I just don't really have a desire to do that personally. Alright. I guess we'll go check out the fishing rods today. If anyone wants to talk, we can talk fun family memories. Let's turn the tide. Well, I'm all out of those, so if any of you guys have any. Oh, quest. Slime hunter slay eight red slimes. Uh, uh, I don't know if I feel like doing that. I just don't know. Alex never sees me trash picking. Like, I trash pick next to him every day. He never sees me. But if I do it here, he'll see me every time. Never fails. 
Smiley says, it's okay, Akita. Due to my health issues, I can't and don't want to have kids either. Yeah, I think a lot of people are, like, weird about it. Like, if you don't want to, it's like, well, why not? It's like, because I don't want to. Like, not every, not every person is meant to have kids. So... Dr. Rain says, if you become a parent, you can be better than your mom. Yeah, that would be the goal if that would happen. <laughs> but, uh... I'm so much of a child myself. <laughs> I want to have fun. I don't want to be tied down to that kind of responsibility. Know what I mean? Because once you have a kid, it's got to be all about them, you know? It's a big, big responsibility. And I am not really uh, up for that. There's a lot of different bobs. Iridium rot. Holy crap. That sucker is expensive. I was thinking like maybe 3,000. You can keep your rod, sir. Veronica says, I'm honestly scared to have kids because I don't want them to have a childhood like I did. I think a lot of people who have messed up parents are like that. Feel the same way. I mean, I think that if you're that aware of it, you're not going to make the same mistakes, but I know what you mean. Why would Clint throw away iron ore? That doesn't even make sense. <laughs> what the heck are you doing, Clint? I'm running into the wall because I'm trying to read the chat at the same time as playing. Smiley says, well, this week I had a ruptured ovarian cyst and went to the ER in an ambulance. Jesus. Are, are you okay? That's horrible. And then Nightbot ruins the mood by saying, check out my YouTube channel. So Rad says, I don't have the mental and emotional capacity to ever care for children. I'm really impatient, and I feel like that would not be good. <laughs> and I would be so worried about something happening to them. So... I think it's just best for everyone if that doesn't happen. Oh my gosh, I keep forgetting to like check on my fruit. On my fruit bat. My fruit bat. Alright, I'm gonna sell these. Hmm. Let's see. I guess I'll take all this stuff. And my fishing rod. Well, I hope you're feeling better, smileys. That really sucks. This game brings out the feels. <laughs> the weird thing is, there's now 32 people watching, and there used to be like 25, so... <laughs> kind of a little strange. Everybody just wants to... wants to chill and have feels. But yeah, definitely try to rest up some Miley's and try to feel try to feel better if you can. That really sucks. I always feel really bad when I'm like when I have a bad day and then I hear that somebody's dealing with that and I'm like, wow. Whiner. <laughs> Thirty-two people watching this emotional train wreck. Damn straight. 
the stream of feels. All aboard the feels train. Captain Quinlan says, I'm enough of a child for you to handle. And I'm not even with you most times. That's true. Gotta feed you, water you, drive you around. Take you to Dairy Queen. Very needy child. Everybody flocks to the field like Hita flocks to materials. Hita flocks to hoarding materials. Hita has a problem with hoarding. I totally forgot that I'd upgraded my pickaxe and I can break these like weird leaf shaped rocks. No, sight, 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 sight. Captain Quindlin, you need a car before you can drive yourself, dear. Smiley says, when I was like eight, I thought storm watch alerts meant to go outside and watch storms. That's pretty much the opposite of what you should be doing. Our dick snail says, my mom passed away two weeks before I graduated from high school. It's coming up on the second anniversary of her death. Oh my gosh. I'm sorry. The stream is getting too real, guys. Sarad says, I feel like after this I'll need to watch Barbie Life in the Dream House and try to forget all this stuff. <laughs> True. Or you could go watch me play Barbie Magic Hairstyler. I mean, I'm just saying the video is still up. Someday we're playing Barbie Detective. Like, I'm streaming it. It's gonna happen. Pika Stews, I can't handle this, guys. I'm out. Sorry. Cat videos. Cat videos would help. Rack Spectac said, I've said it once, I'll say it again. Don't cross the streams. It's crazy what goes on in streams, man. Key to give a promo to her vids. Heck yes, I am. If only I could get a brand deal with myself. That would be odd. This video is sponsored by Kita. Cracking Knuckles says, I've always wanted to be a meteorologist when I was younger. Moving to a desert kills the dream. You can still do that. Just move somewhere else. I really hope to move someday. I don't like where I live. I never have. And, uh, I've always really wanted to move. I'm a lot happier in the sunshine. And it gets kind of cold here. Arctic Snail says, it's sad because I thought I was getting over it, but lately I realized I haven't. Well, that kind of thing takes a long time to get, you know, to make peace with. It's not something you can expect yourself to just kind of wake up and be over and... Oh my gosh, I'm like stuck. I'm stuck. Gotta watch my stamina over there. What do I have left? Eh, I'm good for a little bit. when you're freaking stuck in the forest that is your own farm. Man, I keep thinking I'm making progress and then I'm not. Mirak Spectag says, being in Ohio, I obviously know how you feel, LOL. I'm, I'm not so negative about my state. Most people I know are though. I am negative about my state. <laughs> I, ugh. 
ready to get out of here. Veronica Sless says, do you guys ever cringe over something embarrassing you've done like 10 years ago? Yes. It'll just come back to me and then I'll be like, wow, I was stupid. It happens more often than it should. Oh my gosh, my fingers are like, ugh, I gotta move them. They're going numb from the keyboard. Sarad keeps trying to lighten the mood. Sarad keeps trying. Does anybody want to tell me when the next festival is? The Halloween thing? That would be helpful. Smiley says, I live in Nebraska and people are Bible thumping, Mormon correcting, two faced people. Well, that sounds pretty similar to where I live. Veronica Celeste, Light in the Mood, favorite song in season and why? Sarat says, I'm trying, please. <gasps> I don't know how to stop the sadness. You're doing a good job. Okay. Time to water the crops. <laughs> <laughs> Just start singing I'm a Barbie girl. Oh man, Aqua. I actually preferred their song Candyman to Barbie Girl. I think it was Aqua that did Candyman. No, don't water the thing. Lindsay Sterling is awesome. I love her stuff. I know my 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 grass is growing out of control. It's really annoying. But like my silo is full, so I feel like if I cut it down, then I'm wasting it. Does it die over the winter? It does in some other games, so I didn't know if it did here too. Ah! Freaking watering can. Why well, always gotta fail me? I am thinking about building a second one. I don't think I have enough copper though. And I've been too lazy to go into like the earlier sections of the mine to get some. Lazy. I probably should. I don't know how much I have. How much do I have? Well, I have four copper bars, so I only need like, oh man, I only need one more piece. And then, cause I think you need five copper, or is it iron? Guys, I forget. All the grass dies in winter. Well, that works. Um, I don't know what to do today. I guess we could try going deeper in the mine. Get some, get some goodies for that. I need to check when the next festival is. Uh all the field snacks. Dog, you are so dumb. Fruits is... Fruits is and creepy bats. No, don't eat it. Oh, goodness. She always wants to eat everything. Jeez. Okay. We're armed with a ton of field snacks. I think we're good. 
Five copper bars, ten clay, a hundred stone, and hundred gold. And the next festival is twenty-seven. Thank you. Thank you. I meant to sell those eggplants. Dang it. Thank you very much, Cracking Knuckles. Or Knuckle. Just one Knuckle, I guess. You want a pumpkin? Man, she would have given me more than Caroline did, and I don't think I have... I don't think I have another pumpkin. Dang it. Curses. Makes me sad. Alright. Hey, Pierre, how about you sell... Uh, seeds for spring because I mean that would be the intelligent thing for you to do just saying oh hello little blackberry are you guys coming out again there used to be a ton like everywhere and they disappeared. If you need fast money, you can sell your fruits and vegetables to Pierre. Cool. Great. I guess I'll go get back my energy. I guess. Oh. Smiley says, I remember one night on Back to Nature when I first discovered the dog that came to your farm at night. I know, right? He's so creepy. And evil. Such an evil dog. I think, though, if you use stones to build your fences, there was, uh, it was less likely to get to your animals, if I remember correctly. Sarat, I have not seen that. Veronica Sliss says, I'm painting my nails and the smell is giving me a horrible headache. Um, stop painting your nails? <laughs> or like, sniff something better? <laughs> Go sniff something better. I don't even know what you guys are talking about. The B movie. Must have missed that thread. I just keep seeing things about the B movie. <sighs> Alright. So we're all stamina up. So we can head into the mine. Try to get down another five floors. Sylvie so says, I can't wait to be married so the spouse can do my chores at the farm. I thought, at first I thought you meant in real life, and then, and then I finished reading your, uh, and then I finished reading and I was like, oh, <laughs> you're, you mean, uh, in the game. <laughs> Keaton in a bikini getting the sexy man. Yeah, that's my life, totally. Okay, you want you want me to tell you something better to smell? I don't know. Febreze yourself. Clearly, that's the answer here. Sarad says, I'm partially responsible for our discussions on modern cinematic art. Ah, so you started the B-movie thing. Don't be sneezing on my stream back there. Oh my gosh. Get away, red slimes. And bat. Don't. You don't. I have no quarrel with you. I would like to find a ladder. I mean, it would be nice. No! Get away! I know your game. Your poison game. Piece of crap. 
That's right, get out of here. Oh my gosh, the bats, why? Can't you just leave me alone? Jeez. I just imagine Kita going to the hot spring and every time Careless Whisper playing in the background. Ah! Oh my gosh. What? I can be the chill. I can be the mom and you can be the children. I didn't sign up for that. There's like 2,000 subs now. That's a lot of children. That's a lot of children. Some of you are older than I am. <laughs> Some of you are older than 85, I know it. What? Ladder, where are you? I don't have time for your games, ladder. Does it look like I have time for your games? Cause I don't. That stupid slime is probably, it's probably like right here. Well, that's great logic. Few more followers, and Keto will eventually have her own cult following. Well, my eventual goal is world domination, so. Veronica Celeste says, Holy shit, if you're younger than me, then that's awkward. Well, how old are you? And I'll tell you. Zexter says, I already have I already have four moms, so I don't need another. You don't need a shitty one either. So, Kita cult. Well, if you want to be a cult, at least think of a good name for yourselves. Veronica Celeste, you're 18. Yeah, I'm older than you then. That would be really funny if this whole time I was like 13 though. You guys gotta- you guys gotta admit. That would be pretty funny. This whole time. I was only five. He's actually a 12 year old boy, he just sounds like a girl. Accurate. Can't deny that. I don't know, I think I'd do, I think I'd do a pretty good um, young boy voice for Pietro, if anybody watches that series. Captain Quinlan, everybody knows that you're five. It's not news to anyone. Alright, 8pm, can we get to the final floor? I think we can. After I eat this field snack. Zextra says I'm six on the inside. Arctic Snail says, Kita, what do you think of snails? I think they're the cutest little things. I don't have a lot of experience with snails. I mean, in theory, like, I guess they're all right. I don't really touch them. <laughs> or experience snails <laughs> enough to really make a good judgment. Surad says I'm actually 11, so... Veronica Celeste says, I may be 18 and a legal adult, but don't be fooled. I don't know what the hell I'm doing. Guess what? Neither do I, and I'm older than you, so... I still have no idea. And I don't know if I ever will. That's the scary thing. Oh god, 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 no. No, 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 no. Just eat everything. Okay. No, I don't want to die again. It was horrible. Especially when I'm so close. Like, I don't want that to happen. Oh, okay, we made it. Oh, come on! Can we not? Can we not? I don't- I didn't sign up for this. Damn it! I don't-
Field Snack. Saved by Field Snack. No! No! Come on, I'm gonna die here. What a terrible place to die. Can I just live? Good lord. Batman and summon the Legion of Bats? God damn it, what'd I tell you about that? Uh, FK306, I am younger than you. Oh my god, well this is onslaught. Batman, what have I done? I didn't kill your parents, I swear! It wasn't me! Good god, they're just not dying. Ah! Jeez. Man, now it's 1040. How am I ever gonna get two, two frickin' ladders before 12 o'clock? Like, it's just not gonna happen. Oh, and there's another bat just sitting there waiting. I see that piece of crap. I see you. No! Get away. The shadow man is so weird. Like, what is his problem? Ugh. I just, I just want a ladder. Did I miss it? If you guys see it, and I don't see it, please tell me. That's happened before. Persistence. Oh man, come on. Can I just? Uh, oh my gosh. No. Oh come on, man. One more, and I don't even have enough to make a stone ladder either. All right, we gotta go. Do you check the TV to see if you were lucky? No, I didn't. Psychic Demon says, "Key, did you hate bats?" I, I don't. In theory, no, but I feel like if one was coming at me, I would probably do that. Like I would probably freak out. But. If I'm just thinking about them, they don't creep me out. But if there was, like, one in my house, I would probably be creeped out. Alright, I'm running. I'm running. Here I go. Alright, let's drop off some crap real quick. Uh, Alright, guys, don't let me forget to take bombs with me next time. They're hard to direct after you call them. God damn it, Batman. Sick of your shit. You should have complete control over them. What's wrong with you? Oh my gosh, I could have used the stupid minecart. What the heck? I totally f oh my gosh. He is never lucky, obviously, obviously. Yeah, why did I not use the- I think I just panicked and then I just ran away. <laughs> Sums up my life, pretty much. So I just ran away. Um, Mirax Spectac says, Kitty, you should do drunk streaming if she is in fact over 21. Did you not listen when I said I don't drink? Because <laughs> I don't. I do not drink too many alcoholics in my family. My sister's dad actually died of uh, cirrhosis of the liver, which was caused by drinking, so yeah, not really my thing. Oh, Merrick Spectac, you're probably away. Did you miss that whole really deep, deep bonding that we did? It was very depressing. <laughs> yeah, it's okay. I'm not offended. People are like, people are really weirded out by it though. Like, people give me a hard time for it, which is kind of annoying. We 
If you could learn three languages, what would you learn? Um, I would want to learn, uh, I would definitely want to learn Latin just because I feel like that would really help me learn other languages. Um, I think that would be helpful. Beyond that, uh, probably Japanese. That would be pretty cool. I don't know what the last one would be. Something different, like Russian or something. Postscript Plum XX says, Hi, I'm new to your stream. Seems great so far. Well, thank you. Uh, it's, it's happier now. <laughs> I also have a YouTube channel. So if you like what you see, you could check me out over there too. I have several Stardew Valley videos on YouTube. And I post my streams there too. So that people can watch the whole thing. Like, they don't have to worry about being here when I'm streaming, so. FK306 says, I miss the sad bond. <laughs> oh my gosh. When the streams get too real. Zextra says, am I the only one that wants to speak animal? Well, is it one language, or... Does each animal have their own language, though? Sign language would be useful to learn, actually. I didn't think of that. Morse code. Mirak Spectac said, Took a semester of Russian. It's pretty cool, but the rules are weird. I like how all the words are pronounced as if they're spelled, though. That would be useful. English doesn't really adhere to that rule. <laughs> okay, so we got... Oh... I guess I'll have to keep the sunflower seeds for for next year because they will not grow. There's not enough time. But uh, what do we got? What do we got? Uh, where did I put the sunflowers? Where did I put the sunflowers? Too many chests. So much hoarding. Like, okay, there we go. I'll sell one of them. Um, Sell that, sell that. I think Okay, I need to put some stuff in the preserver things. So, put some more grapes in there. And... So much hoarding is going on with these cranberries. But, it'll really help me during the winter. Because... Uh, there's not a lot of income. At least in most Harvest Moon games. There's not, you don't really have a lot of income during the winter. Although fishing might, fishing might help that. And obviously mining. I don't know, let's see, what time is it? It is 9.30. Um, let's see. My grandfather just texted me. He and my grandmother are in Disney. And he said, Nan forced me to go on Big Thunder Mountain Railroad Coaster today in Magic Kingdom. First and last time in 40 years. <laughs> I don't think he's going to go on any other roller coasters. He's like kind of a chicken. That is hilarious. And I really wish that there was a picture. Does that one take your picture? Because I really hope she bought that picture. I will pay her for that. I'm going to text him back and be like, did you buy the picture? I really hope so. Captain Quindolin, Nan and Papa are in Disney? Yes, they are. Again, they were just there in December, and now they're there again, and they didn't take me, and I'm really sad about it. Uh, yes, I do live on the East Coast. I missed something. I don't know if somebody asked me something, but yes, I live on the East Coast. Cracky Knuckle says, if no crops grow during winter, it's probably best to build as much kegs as you can to process wine? I don't know if I have... Do I have that ability yet? I have the uh, cheese press, mayonnaise machine, a loom. 
a recycling machine, preserves jar, charcoal kiln. I don't think I have any way to make wine yet. Yeah, I don't think I do. You don't have to build a separate building, do you? Angry Chieftain, welcome back. <clears throat> Artisan products like wine are a lot of gold, really? Yeah, I guess I just haven't... I don't... I probably have to level up something. My farming is level 8. That's pretty good. So it's probably something else I need to level up. You unlock the keg with level 6 farming? Are you sure? Because I don't think I have that. I don't remember... I don't remember seeing that either. Gwendolyn, Mod, do you want to look that up? When you get the uh, keg for making wine. That would be useful. And Captain Quindolin is my cousin. So yes, we are related. My dad is her mom's brother. Little known fact. Um, I really want to get to the last thing in the mine. I really want to do that. <laughs> Um, so I think we're going to try to do that today. And then... Go from there. Goals. You unlock it at level 8 farming? I thought I was level 8 farming. What is going on? It says I'm level 8. You guys didn't see it, right? Cheese press, mayonnaise maker, loom, recycling machine, preserves jar, chest, truckle kiln, bee house, furnace. Like, I'm not seeing it. Captain Quinlan says I looked up but didn't get an answer. I love how there's like five different conversations going on right now. <laughs> Scroll down. Yeah, this is all I got. Weird, you should have it. What the heck? I'm sad now. Are you guys sure it's not level 9? Because I... This is like all I got. What the heck? Yeah, I, I don't have it. And I don't remember it ever saying like... Hey, you can do this. Like, that's not one that I remember, so... We're gonna head over to... Uh, town, which basically just takes you here. And get those geodes processed before we head to the mine. FK306 says, I looked up and said level 8. Well, what the heck? Oh, other people are saying level 9? But level 9 is a seed maker? Huh. I don't know. Maybe it's because of different things that I picked? What is that? Hematite? That sounds like a disease. Awesome. I needed that copper. Thank you very much, Clinty. Clinty, Clinty. Ooh, lots of stuff to donate. Tiger's eye. Level 8 is keg and level 9 is seed maker. What the heck? I don't understand why I didn't get it then. Is it because I picked the tiller perk, maybe? I don't know. We'll see. Once I get to level 9, we'll see if it unlocks or not. Maybe I'm just unlucky. <gasps> Wouldn't be the first time. Or a bugged game. Yeah, if I don't get it, like if I level up again I don't get it, I will tweet a uh, concerned ape. Oh my gosh, I'm like running out of room. Still no reward? Dude. Come on, man. Super K Brown 95. Have you ever had to ban someone from your Twitch or YouTube? I've had to block someone from YouTube once. But that was it. Uh, you got banned. That wasn't my fault, though. That was Nightbot. Nightbot was being sassy. Because you post a link and Nightbot was like. Bah, 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 bah.
Thank you for following. I appreciate it. Okay. All right, so we're gonna make a copper bar so that we can build another silo. Oh, did I not grab enough? Ugh. Fine. Fine, I don't feel like dealing with you. Fire quartz, why do I have that? Whatever. All right, so we're going to the mine. Sassy mind bot date. <laughs> you don't wanna date Nightbot, Nightbot's a sass bag. Yeah, uh, Nightbot's like pretty much automatically set to ban links because I'm sure other Twitch streamers have had issues with links. I have not, but I just kind of like left most of the defaults up. Um, but I haven't had a problem, so I went into Nightbot settings and now people can post links. It's just if it gets to be at like a point where people are spamming, then I will probably uh, set it back. I didn't realize the Nightbot would be, like, really nasty about it, though. I thought it would just, like, give you a warning first. And it didn't. <laughs> Veronica Celeste says, why did you block them? Uh, because they were being mean. <laughs> I shouldn't say it like that. It was just, like, somebody who was being kind of trolly, like, just came on and was like, blah, 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 I hate all your stuff, you're such a terrible person, blah, blah, blah. And I was just like, then don't watch. Like, <laughs> it's a waste of your time to watch my stuff if you don't like it. Like, I'm not going to be offended, just don't watch it, you know what I mean? I just don't understand why people take the time to, like, post those kinds of comments. And then was and then this person was like commenting on other people's comments to me. So I was like, no, I'm not dealing with this. So but it was only once. I'm a small channel, so I don't really get a lot of hate. I'm sure if my channel ever grows that I will, but that's just kinda comes with the territory, unfortunately. I just don't understand why people take the time to do that, like I've seen plenty of YouTube videos I didn't like. I just click away, you know? Like, why spread the negativity? I would rather comment on, on a video that I enjoy than comment on a video I don't like, you know? Because you're not going to stop that person. Like, I don't really know what they... Do they really think that if they comment, I hate you, that you're going to stop making videos? Because probably not going to happen. And... If it did happen, that would be really sad. You shouldn't let somebody else run your life like that. So. But it was just once. So. I really hope I never have to do it again. Because I wish more people would be not jerks. Like, that's totally fine if you don't like my stuff. That's It's not for everyone, you know. Everyone has different tastes. Just, like, don't watch it. <laughs> you know? Just, like, leave. <laughs> Quietly. I'm not gonna be offended. Smiley says, It feels weird to switch play between Story of Seasons and Stardew because of the different time mechanics. I feel like Story of Seasons stresses me out more because I have so much that I'm doing right now so I'm constantly having to manage my time in that game and I'm constantly running out of time like running between all the fields and it's crazy I kind of wish that they would make certain features a little bit less intense if you know what I mean like make it a little bit simpler because it's a lot to deal with. I really like the way that um, Concerned Ape did, did this. Like, you can just put the stuff... Like, you can put berries in the preserve jar and just kind of, like, walk away. Whereas in Story of Seasons, like, if you're, if you're doing, like, linen cloth or whatever, you gotta put it in 
you gotta make the yarn, and then you gotta dye the yarn, and then, you, you know, you're constantly doing stuff. And it's a little bit, it gets a little intense. Uh, Super K Brown 95 says, from 1 to 10, with 10 being a dead lookalike, how close is your profile picture to how you look in real life? Um, fairly close. I don't have the blonde in my hair anymore. I did have a blonde streak and half my bangs blonde for a while. I want to do it again. I've just been, like, super lazy, so I haven't. Um, my hair is naturally dark, but I dye it black because it gets red in it. I'm Irish, and I have always gotten red in my hair, and it's kind of annoying. So I like to dye it dark because then it just takes it out. Um, I think in the picture, my eyes are black, which obviously they aren't. They're brown. But fairly close. My hair is really long, and it's pretty straight. So... Ah! I don't know. Eco Batman, Captain Quindolin, do you have any... You would... Okay, well, we have two ladders. Do you guys have a have anything in any input? It's always weird to answer questions about myself like that. <gasps> what is this? What is this? Look! 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 Beautiful. What is this? You found the skull key. You're not sure what it's for, but it seems important. It's been added to your wallet. What is it? I don't know. What do you mean it's been added to my wallet? I don't see it here. Oh, but I did reach the bottom of the mine. The skull key. You found a strange looking key at the bottom of the mine. Discover the purpose of the skull key. Well, okay then. Oh yeah, Captain Quinlan's right. I have bangs now, but they are getting really long, so I've been kind of pushing them off to the side, so it's kind of still similar. Bus stop! Cracky Knuckles says, I honestly like how hard the game is. A lot of games nowadays are just too easy. Yeah, I mean, th the only thing is with uh, Harvest Moon games, I kind of go into it expecting something more relaxed, and with Story of Seasons, I'm on year three, and I have so much that I'm doing all the time. So it feels more like... I feel more stressed. Oh, thank you so much for the follow. Really appreciate that. Um, but I feel more stressed with it. And I like kind of just chilling. When I'm playing a Harvest Moon type game. If it's a different kind of game, then that's fine. But I kind of expect Harvest Moon to be a little bit more chill. Alright, tomorrow we need to get a silo... We need to start getting our second silo built. That's important. I'm pretty sure I've given all of these to the museum. So. We gotta figure out what to do with that key, though. Important. Put my 50,000 field snacks away. Also, somebody said there was another mine or something. I didn't know that. Ego Batman says the thumbnail of you doesn't capture the epic length of your hair. <gasps> oh, there we go. Thank you. Thank you for that, uh, cracking knuckle. You're very knowledgeable. <laughs> I could get a coop, but I'm kind of just waiting on that. Haha! -ha! Level 8 farming. Wasn't I at- You guys saw that though, right? I was at level 8 farming. Maybe because it happened during the day and you have to like- It has to be at night that you level up. But it definitely said level 8, right? I think it did. Um, but anyway, so we have watering can and hoe proficiency, which is my favorite kind of proficiency. And then we have a new craft- A new crafting recipe keg and a new crafting recipe oil maker. Okay. And deluxe speed grow. Hmm. Super K Brown 95 says, do you watch We Bear Bears? Um, I have. I think it's really funny. I love Dimitri Martin. He voices Ice Bear, and Ice Bear is my favorite. Ice Bear loves Ninja Stars. <laughs> He's so funny. I am the Ice Bear of We Bear Bears, for real. And I'm sorry about whatever's going on between Veronica, Celeste, and Smiley's. I'm just getting bits and pieces, so I feel like I can't really comment on what is going on there. But it seems like there are more feels going on.
And now I get a pumpkin, of course, after I needed it for a quest. Figures. I think, I think I just, it, I think it just didn't count that I leveled up because it doesn't happen until you go to sleep for that night. But I think I actually reached the level. Don't start barking. Allie, don't start barking. Nobody's out there. I know you think that someone's out there, but nobody's out there, I promise. Ice Bear for life. Ice Bear is my favorite. I haven't watched it though, just because um, it's not on Netflix, at least to my knowledge. I feel like if it were, it'd be easier to watch. Oh, thank you for the follow, whoever that was. I heard the, I heard the Crash Bandicoot. Um, I watch it on Kiss Cartoon sometimes but it's more cumbersome to do that. I'm just so lazy with Netflix. <laughs> but I do like the show. I also like Steven Universe before anybody asks. <laughs> that show is great too. You need to finish 100% of the money bundles to unlock the next mine. Oh, okay. Well, that, that's gonna be a while. <laughs> okay, so we need to figure out what to do with the key. I guess I'll take my fishing rod with me. And we're just gonna go into life, into the town. Uh, Smiley says, Kita, I just feel strongly for people that have serious diseases and disorders. I've had people harass me by saying I have Down syndrome and some other awful things. What the heck? I wasn't hurt by it, but I felt for her how demeaning how much demeaning there is to those diseases and disorders for those who do not have it I didn't I, I didn't really catch like what the whole thing was so I didn't feel like I could really comment I just saw that you guys were talking about autism but I didn't want to comment because I didn't know like the extent of what you guys were saying Cracking Nickel says, I have Asperger's and I still get messed with because my social life sucks. That's, that's really crappy. I don't get why people can't just shut up. <laughs> and I'm sorry that you have to go through that because nobody should have to deal with that crap. Um, my favorite gem is probably Garnet. I love Garnet so much. It's really funny. Shake the meat! That was, that was like the best episode. When they're in the arcade. <laughs> Veronica Celeste says the aut autism chat started because I mentioned about a leafy about leafy a, a YouTuber making a hate bashing video about an autistic YouTuber, and his one million subs went to his channel and let the most brutal and hate filled comments. W Is that what that was? Because I heard other people commenting about the leafy whatever thing. I didn't know what was going on. I try to stay out of that stuff. I didn't know like what. I just knew that leafy did something and people were pissed off about it. I I don't know why you would do why you would use your influence to do that to anyone. I mean I don't think some YouTubers realize just how much power they have. 
when you have that many people following you, you really have to watch what you what you do and what you say. Because you're really influencing people, especially young people. No, Elliot, we we have this. Oh, we got Elliot to four stars, yay! Sarad says, I like the episode where Garnet jumps out of the car. Because <laughs> the music. That was really funny. Smileys, you should let your light shine and not let anybody else dim it. Because that is just doing a disservice to yourself. Does anybody know where that key goes? I have a feeling, but I don't know for sure. Jody would like to hire someone to fetch a frozen tear. That is very strange. I don't... I know I have one. I don't know if I have an extra one, though. This will, this will like, forever be known as the stream that got real. Triple Strike says, I think it's the one that goes in the game machine in Tavern. Okay. Uh, yeah, there's some issues with, uh, with YouTube. I don't think that they banned him. I would be very surprised if they did, to be honest. What is- what the heck? It unlocks a skull mine in the Calico Desert. You must- you must have unlo unlocked a bus stop to get to it? Oh, okay. I don't know what's happening right now, though. Oh god. <laughs> what is this? What is the point of this? No! Frick. Chadtronics got me saying frick, man. <laughs> Frickin' fricks! I think somebody asked me earlier who my favorite YouTubers are to watch. I feel like somebody asked that and I never answered. I'm assuming you were asking me. Maybe you're not asking me. Um, my favorite YouTubers are probably Lukagen. I love Lukagen's stuff. She always makes me laugh. She has really good streams as well and I just keep dying. Um, I like Lukagen a lot. I like Brutal Moose a lot. He's really funny. He, he has very similar humor to me. He's very, like, sarcastic and very, like, dry kind of sense of humor. And uh, he does really funny streams, too. I really like watching his streams. Um, I'm just dying. It needs to stop. It's still happening. Um, I also really love Ketikaris. PS, I love PS stuff, like PlayStation 1 stuff. He gives so much love to PlayStation, so love him. Ah, no. Jimmy Wetzel is great. Uh, Captain Quinlan, he's really funny as well. I feel like all the hidden block uh, guys are really funny. I just started watching the Lazy Game, Lazy Game Reviewer, Lazy Game Reviews, LGR. And, uh, he's good, too. No, stop. I like watching all his PC stuff. And he he does Sims stuff every now and then. It's really funny. And he does thrifting videos, which I love. I always love watching other people's thrifts. Um, who else? Peanut Butter Gamer. I like him a lot. I think the first YouTube gamer that I watched was probably the Angry Video Game Nerd. 
still watch him. He's still hilarious. Um, Dr. Rain says, I have to go eat dinner, but I'll watch the stream when you post on YouTube. Bye. Thank you for coming. I just died again. Thank you for coming to the stream. Really appreciate it. Have a good dinner. I hope it's delicious. I don't even know what I'm doing now. No! Dang it. Have you ever watched K-pop? She is a gamer and it's funny like you. K-pop? I don't think I've ever heard of K-pop, actually. I need to watch more uh, female Let's Players. I do watch Vixella every now and then. She does sim stuff. She does Minecraft, but I don't- I'm not really into Minecraft personally, so I don't really watch the- Come on, man. So I don't really watch those, but she does sims uh, challenges and stuff. She's really- she's really sweet. I like watching her. Um, no! And, uh, Gadget Girl Kylie is really cool, too. Oh, I actually started talking to her on Twitter. And I was surprised because I went to look at her channel because we just started talking about like games and stuff. And I went to look at her channel and she has like 70 some subs and I was like, holy crap. Like, I don't know. It's kind of like this weird stigma that people with, you know, a lot of subs, like you don't really expect them to talk to you if you don't have a lot of subs. You know what I mean? Like, it's just kind of a weird stigma. So I, I, when, you know, she was just talking to me, like, normally, like, we were just having conversations and stuff, and then, um, she, like, I went on her channel to check it out, and I was like, holy crap, <laughs> she's got a lot of subs. But she's really, really nice, and she does a lot of, uh, Vita stuff, which I don't think a lot of people do, so that's really cool. If you're into the, into the PS Vita. Um, where did I put this? In here. There we go. I guess I'll sell these. I don't even know what I'm doing, man. I don't even have, like, I don't even have, like, a goal or anything today. Maybe I'll just clean up the farm a little bit. Because now we reach the bottom of the mine, and I can't really do much else until, uh, until we unlock the next mine, so... Oh, wait. Silo. I was gonna do that. Crap. Oh, she- Does anybody know what time she closes? I probably can't get there in time. Alright, run. Run! All right, see ya, Captain Quindlin. Have fun doing homework, your favorite thing ever. Female gamer recommendation. I do not know how to pronounce that, but she does Sims 4. Well, that's cool. I like I like watching other people play Sims for some weird weird reason. I always feel like my Sims Let's Plays never go well though, or not Let's Plays, but like I've streamed it and I just I don't know. I'm never really happy with the way it comes out. Why did I... That's not what I wanted. Construct farm buildings. Okay, so this is the slime hatch. So that must be why I need slime eggs, I guess. But I don't... I'm poor, so that's not happening. S Smiley says, I think I know who Nightbot's favorite YouTuber is. You know it. I employ Nightbot, so... FK306, I was surprised when you started responding to my comments. I, I really do try to uh, respond because I, I just think that's really important. Like, you guys are taking the time to watch me, so I want to... Why can't I? Seriously? So I want to take the time to try to respond to you. Where should I put this? Where do you guys think I should put this other silo? I don't want it to be in the way of anything. Oh man, I don't have enough for, okay. I will make some more tappers and do that then after I do this. Where should I put the silo? Does anybody have a recommendation? Cause this is the greenhouse I'm pretty sure. 
but I don't know where I want to put this. Block off the dog. <laughs> I could do that. Nightbot is a stalker. Alright, I think I'm gonna just put it... I don't think I can move the dog. The dog bowl. By the grave? See, I want to make sure that I have enough room for, like, my... Yeah, it would kind of have to be, like, in front of the grave, though. I kind of want to make sure that I have enough room for my barn and everything. That's the problem. Like, I really want to... He is in the timeout corner. I hate him. I really want to have, like, a better idea of my farm layout. But it's hard to do when you're building one piece at a time. And I know you can demolish the buildings, but you're still paying for them. Maybe I'll put it, like, all the way over here. I guess I could put it in, like, this little corner. I'll put it there. I'll put it there. It's out of the way. That'll probably come back to bite me in the butt. That's just what happens. But that's where it's going. Okay, so I need to put tappers on oak trees, he said. Which ones are those? I get them confused. Silos are super cheap. Super cheap, that's true. It'd be nice if you got materials back if you demolished a building. I don't know if you do or not. Probably not. Let's see, what do I need to make some tappers? Tappers, tappers. Oh, of course, I need copper. My dog is making really weird noises. She's like... Ugh. in her sleep. It's weird. <laughs> Triple Strike says, I have no idea which tree is which, so I decided to tap them all. Wait, that sounds wrong. <laughs> oh, I thought I got... Fine. No, not that. There we go. Yeah, I don't... I never know either. I'm always like... I ended up putting a bunch of tappers on the same trees. Can you take them off? Oak trees slightly lean to the left. Can you take them off of a tree once you've put them on a tree? Does anybody know? I will try it if nobody knows. Alright. Tapper. There we go. Okay. So we have one. So I guess I'll head down here. Oh my gosh, this grass. Like, I'm living in a field of grass. It's gonna overtake my house soon. If you cut the tree down, you'll get the tapper? Okay. I could do that. Speaking of tappers. Hello. This is all pine tar, so these must all be pine trees. Well, I think I'll cut this one down then. Oh wait, you don't have to cut the tree down, you just hit it with the axe. And it, there you go. What kind of breeds are your dogs? They are all Yorkies. There's three of them. They're small. They are very small. I wanted to put a tapper on this tree, but it wouldn't let me. Why won't it let me? Gert. See, these are all, like, pine trees. Mr. Krabs? What about Mr. Krabs? Are you trying to link something? Bottom right corner of that area? What, of here? Maybe it is a special tree. I kind of want to check in town and see if there's any... Can you can you put tappers on trees in town or not? Ah, it's a meme. Gotcha. <laughs> Are you feeling it now, Mr. Krabs? 
Oh my gosh, this is a long walk, man. Haha. -ha. Well, I got this. Maple syrup. Okay, so I put one there. Okay, so which ones are the oaks then? Is it like this one? The area where the spring onions grow? Isn't that like down here? Is it the gold ones? Can anyone answer? The orange leaf, okay. So, we'll put one there. And we'll put one here. Okay. We also got maple syrup, which is good because we can put it in the thing community center I don't know if that's gonna is that gonna finish it it might it might finish that bundle actually do we have time to make it probably maybe possibly I don't know it's gonna take a while getting through this grass and eh, it might be better to wait till tomorrow I think I'm gonna do that Luna, you are snoring really loudly <coughs> over there. Uh, I think I should keep some of that. I feel like it was used in some kind of recipe. All right. Okay. So we're going to sell the snail, and then tomorrow I'll put the maple syrup in the thing, in the community center. That thing that I'm trying to remember what it's called. Alright. Man, they did not buy the picture <laughs> from the roller coaster. I'm upset about that. I really wanted to see my grandfather's look of horror. He just texted me and said they didn't buy the picture. Why would you not do that? That must have been a glorious picture. I would have bought it. Put it in the thing. Yeah, that's pretty much... How I describe the community center. Put it in the thing. You guys know what I mean. You know exactly what I'm talking about. Corn. Robin better be working on my silo. I paid her a lot of money. Succubus Demon says, I gotta bail out now, so tired. See you another time. I'll see you later. I'm glad that you came out for the stream. There will be another one next Wednesday, and maybe something before that. I don't know yet. Ah! I didn't what? What didn't I do? Oh, you know what? I'm poor, so that was a lot of money. I don't want to hear it from you, sassy. Listen here, I'm broke. Sarad says, I gotta go to sleep. See you next time. Alright, see you later. Who goes to sleep, really? Who sleeps? Sleep is for the weak. <laughs> the feel stream. Veronica Celeste says, I need to make an alarm on my phone. Every Wednesday at 7pm you stream. Well, that would probably keep you from missing it. I don't know, are you... Is everybody able to handle if we have another feel stream? <laughs> Good lord. I don't know if I can handle another one of those. Keep that corn. Ah! No, go in here.
Hmm. I guess I'll keep one more pumpkin. Where the heck are my? They're there. All right. Well, I think I have a good number of those. I'll keep the starred corn though. Hmm. Okay, we're good. Wait. Okay. Um. I guess I'll bring that. Just in case. Alright. So we're gonna go to the community center. I don't know. Is it faster to go this way? I don't know if it is or not. Whatever, it's faster to trash pick. You'll bring sad music, tissues, a pillow, and a hug, and pizza. Well, I'm down for the pizza. Cracking Knuckle says, I think I'll name my farm Luna Soul for when I remake it. That's a nice name. It's a good farm name. I approve. I approve this message. I guess we'll go down here and check the beach. Willie's not going to be selling me that rod, though. I don't want his rod. It's too expensive. Damn, Willie. And his expensive rod. I always see those little worm things when I don't have my hoe. Really need to start taking my hoe everywhere, you know what I'm saying? Your farm name is Farm? <laughs> Smiley's, your creativity astounds me. Veronica Celeste says, I'll bring cookies to the next field train. Please do. Cookies are amazing. Dang it, Lewis. I really wanted to dig in your trash. And then you were there. And you ruined it. Wanted slime hunter. Yeah, well, I'm too lazy for that crap. Sorry. Whoever wanted that. Probably the wizard. Okay. Uh, was it the bulletin board? I can't remember. Which one wanted maple syrup? I think it was the artisan bundle, probably. Well, the, the chef's one wants it, but I think there was a different one, too. Veronica Celeste says, The farm I live on right now in real life is called Little Quentin Farm and Winery, so whenever I play farm game, I just use that name. Well, that works. Exotic foraging, thank you very much. Yes. I was right. Bundle complete. Autumn's bounty, wow. Plus two foraging? Wow, that's... I didn't know that was a thing. But... We only have two more for this whole thing. And then the bridge will be repaired, whatever that means. So that's exciting. It's quite exciting. I think near the end of winter, I'm going to upgrade my watering can. I think that's something I should do. Oh, are the blackberries showing up again? They used to be everywhere. The broken bridge by the mines? Craft jaw, don't mind me, I'm just going full yonder on Miss 137. Bridge the quarry? I didn't know there was a broken bridge by the mines. Oh, yes I do, I know what you're talking about now. Right. It's over here. Gotcha. Okay, well, I'll take it. I guess we'll go in here and check my- Oh, two? Really? Come on. Can you open up at one for me? It looks cool over there. I wanna go over there. Soon. 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 Can you guys, like, open- 
please. I'll shake your tree. Shake both your trees. If you know what I'm saying. I could just fish. I don't know why I'm like being an idiot. I could just fish. Of course, nothing's gonna. Oh, okay. Well, took you long enough, fish. No! I was, I was going for the chest. It's all the chest's fault. Alright. <laughs> Do you know how long it's gonna take me to kill a thousand slimes? How have I not killed 200 bats yet? I feel like... I should have done that. Uh, Sup Super K Brown 95 says, Have you ever played any of Sly Cooper or Ava Escape games? I have not. I have both of them. But I have not played uh, Sly Cooper. I want to, though. It was just something I never had as a kid. But I definitely want to. Because I've heard it's awesome. And I like those kinds of platforming games. Crash Bandicoot's one of my favorite games. Wow, that is, that is a crazy sword, man. Um, Ape Escape, I only played very briefly. I didn't actually play through the whole thing. I was just kind of testing it out. Because I, I think we found it at thrift store or something. So, I was just testing it. There's a lot of games that I would like to just play to just try them out. Because we like pick them up. Um, like at, at the flea market or something. And I never actually tried them. So. I would like to do that. Maybe I'll upgrade my axe. Or my pickaxe. So then I could open that. So it's not just sitting there. But that's a lot of money though. Because it would be gold. Mm, I don't know if I want to do that. Also, freaking Clint. Clinty is closing very soon. But I think I'm going to... Yeah, I have enough iron. I think I'm going to upgrade my axe. Next. And then wait until closer to the end of winter to upgrade my watering can. Put the blackberries in the thing. Um, yeah, I have a bunch of those. Hmm. Alright, we'll make some jelly. And. Hmm. Atheron says, Kid, after you finish Phoenix Wright, so what do you think your next LP will be? Probably Pokemon Yellow. That's what I'm leaning towards. I'll have to see how it does because of Nintendo being Nintendo. I don't think I'll have a problem because it's Game Freak. And not strictly Nintendo. But. That's kind of what I'm leaning towards. Uh, Super K Brown 95 says. Have you ever cosplayed? I have not. I would like to. But I don't have the skills. To make. A cool costume like that. So. I need to befriend someone who has those skills. <laughs> Basically. Penny is the one... Is that the one who is who lives in the trailer with Pam? I feel like that's who that is. But I'm not sure. I need a large mouth bass. Called you a delicious bass. I need it. For the community center. Theron says, I think so long as you don't monetize it, I think you'll be okay. I know of several other LPers that do Nintendo things that don't monetize their videos. Yeah, but the problem is I actually kind of need <laughs> to monetize stuff right now. Um, 
because I don't have a lot of hours at work right now. And that would be a long LP and really time consuming. So I don't know if I would want to just, I don't know if I would want to do that. Plus uh, they'll still claim it. So they might still put ads on it anyway, which is kind of annoying because then they're making revenue off of your video and you're getting nothing for it. Um, and if they want to, they can give you strikes. So it's still kind of risky, but I don't think it'll be an issue because of Game Freak. Uh, because it's Game Freak and not strictly Nintendo. Like it's not, it's not like, you know, uh, Super Mario 3D World or something that's like made by Nintendo. Oh, that's not really what I wanted to do. Theron says, completely understandable. We'll just have to wait and see. Yeah, I mean, if it if it becomes an issue, I might just stream it. I don't know. Because Nintendo doesn't seem to be as snippy with uh, Twitch streams. Probably because they're deleted so frequently that it's hard to... For them to kind of catch you i i don't know but uh i don't know we'll have to see i mean maybe i might do it anyway just depending on how it goes like i'd have to upload a couple videos and see how they do in terms of copyright um but it'll depend if i'm in the mood to play it i'm gonna play it you know i would much rather uh, have fun playing a game than dread it, even if it is, you know, pulling in the views. Yeah, that sucks for Penny. She seems nice. I haven't really talked to her much, though. In the game. Triple Strike says, I think you can only find largemouth bass in the lake by the Adventurer's Guild? Aw, oh, man. I never find anything that the community center wants really in terms of fish i feel like i never get what they want another female gamer recommendation yokai ying she's very sweet and plays rpgs oh okay good to pass the names around it's kind of hard to find female let's players I've actually had a, several people say to me, like, oh, you're a female and you're playing Stardew Valley. Because I guess there's a lot of guys playing it, and obviously, like, they're going to play the guy character, so. I think there are people who want to see the female character. So that's cool. There's probably going to be some time between Phoenix Wright and Pokemon Yellow, though, because I kind of bogged myself down with too much, like too many LPs at once. It, it is nice that I'm just um, streaming Stardew Valley now, though, because when I was trying to do recorded, edited videos, it was like crazy to do four Let's Players at once. So, <laughs> did I say four Let's Players? I meant four Let's Plays at once. Um, it's like too much <laughs> and I was burning myself out so I don't know if I'm going to do Pokemon Yellow right away or not yeah there's a bunch of people who left it's getting later it's understandable I'm probably going to quit soon too I don't want to though because like we're so close to the next festival but it'll probably happen. It's been a long stream. All right, I should probably head back. Should probably head back. It's getting late. I don't know. The nice thing about streaming is I can kind of play whatever I want. I don't really have to, like, necessarily play it through the whole way, whereas, like, with Let's Plays, it's more of a commitment. So, I don't know. I might stream some games that I really like, 
but don't think would work for a full Let's Play. Like, I don't know, I might stream Mass Effect or something. Just for, for giggles. Because that's one of my favorite games ever. Arctic Snail says, feel free to take breaks from Let's Plays. Don't tire yourself out. Oh my gosh, I do. Sometimes. Well, especially because, like, people ask for them and then... Like, I like that they're excited for it, and then, like, I feel like <laughs> I don't want to let people down, so. So I overwork myself a lot. It's a problem. Are there fish in the ponds on your farm here? I don't know. Or are you saying, did I put any in there? Because I didn't know that that was a thing. If that is a thing. Can you put fish in the ponds? Wow. A stone. How exciting. You can place crab pots in the larger lake on your farm. Oh, okay. Did not know that. Hmm. Okay. Yeah, I didn't know that I could put them on my farm. The little crab pots. Yeah, I don't know if you can put fish in there or not. I... I have... Nobody said anything about it, so I'm guessing no. But I don't want to say for sure, because I don't... I don't really know. That would be easier to maintain than the ocean, because a lot of times I don't get to the ocean. Salt? Who's salty? I'm not salty. Oh my gosh, Nightbot. Your little biased night bot. Hmm. Alright, well, it's been three and a half hours. So, I think I'm gonna end the stream. But... I might stream this weekend, possibly. We'll see. Um... I don't know yet, and I don't know what I'll be streaming. I might stream Stardew, but I might stream something else too. Kind of depends on what I'm in the mood for. And it also depends on if we find anything at the flea market. Um, which we might. You just love the salt towards the stone? Oh, <laughs> there was salt towards the stone. But uh, anyway, yeah, definitely come check out the stream next week, obviously, because I'll be streaming again on Wednesday. Uh, and then possibly before that. So possibly might stream sometime over the weekend. If I have time, we'll have to see. It really depends. The schedule's kind of hard to predict. But uh, yeah, thank you guys so much for coming out and hanging out with the stream. A bunch of you guys are have been here like the whole stream which is crazy but yeah thank you guys so much for coming out i will definitely let you know if i'm going to be streaming this weekend uh happy hoeing <laughs> i'm always hoeing even when you guys aren't around but yeah thank you guys for coming to the stream and i hope to see you at the next one and you can look for return to popolo croix on my channel that's coming up and possibly another phoenix right if i can get it done it just takes a while. We'll have to see. But thank you guys so much for s sticking around. And I will see you next.